a sports team. All right, guys. All right. I feel like we, we usually start off our sessions with a good hearty laughter that no one in the audience understands. Um, You're welcome. And we aim to continue that. Moving on with no context. Probably. <laughs> it's the tradition of all. So, when last we left our heroes. Oh, I should probably introduce this show. Yeah. Um, this hey. is a show. Oh, we're just doing a thing. Watch uh, it. So, welcome to this episode of D20 Theater. Sponsored by Dr. Pepper. No. 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 <laughs> no. Not even a little bit. No. Uh, welcome to this episode of D20 Theater. Um, total Party Watch Edition. All right. Yay. When last we left our heroes. <clears throat> when last we left our heroes, the party had made the, I'm sure, tremendously wise, totally fine, no consequence forming decision to, uh, to split the party. The monk and the wizard chose to stay and help kind of foul up the final contest uh, among the, the choosing of the Morskov, is that right? Yeah. Uh, which was a social game because uh, he's got spells and she's awkward. And so the ta da! Uh, th that was their goal. Uh, their goal was to foil Thiakar's attempts to uh, to gain to curry favor among his uh, his his countrymen, I suppose, his, yeah, his hillmen. Uh, while the rest of us, the the three, the the druid, the cleric, and the silencer, uh, elected to chase off in pursuit of the uh, the dreamer Let's that our wizard had encountered. Let's hunt some orcs. Uh, you know, the fourth, the three kindreds, men, halflings, and big dragon <laughs> Big, big, big scale boys. So we uh, we did go in pursuit. We had to fight a cyclopean, but just the one because our our tree druid uh, broke a, a cave on the other one's head. So that was good. Um, I'm I'm out of javelins now. We encountered the uh, the dreamer and were able, after much much uh, struggle, to overcome him. But we are now rather low on resources and keenly aware of the fact that orcs are approaching the. Uh, the hill tribe encampment <clears throat> at any moment, uh, and so we are now left uh, with the with the decision on whether to ride back now, depleted as we are, or wait and rest and risk the utter ruin of our friends and our plans. And I believe that would. Oh, and and then over there where they were, they did manage to foil uh, Theocra's plans, and uh, th our our hill tribe buddy was found murdered by Theocra and his guys. Bummer. And then Theocra and his guys ran off to go make war with the Hayfork. So, um, one of our one of our two uh, one of the two other chieftains, with some encouragement, with some encouragement from our our wizard friend, uh, was able to. Sir, my surprise guest, it's Colby's dad. Papa Sable. Oh uh, well, uh, to those in the audience, sorry about the interruption. My, uh, my dad just showed up. So if you want to say hi to the cameras, you can. Hi, Cam. There you go. Hey, chat. <laughs> right. Well, uh, thank you for some advice. So let me know if you uh, if you decide on dinner so, uh, next week. Yeah, I'll, it'll be. Or just you're talking about this. Yeah. yeah. Okay, I'll let All you right. know. Cool. All right, y'all have fun. All Thanks, right, sir. Oh, um, one of the two chieftains, with some uh, encouragement from our wizard, chose to uh, head off in pursuit of Theoker's men, while the other, uh, Arden, chose to stay and stand alongside the remainder of the Hill Tribe forces and our two allies, as the orc menace did indeed appear over the horizon, led by. The Akar who had led the assault on Aberdavi, whose name Garkul, is Garkul Akar, yeah. Akar uh, who had previously bested Thaddeus rather handily in single combat. And I believe, Colby, that that does in fact bring us up to speed, albeit with something of a pause in the middle. Sorry about that. All right, guys. Well, I've been handed a box, so I'm going to decide or figure out what this box is, because who knows? Maybe it'll be useful to tonight's session. A box of many things. <clears throat> I don't know. It may be a it's box a of present. Boxes. Yeah. So. You, you, you two it's folks five new D&D characters. But, uh, thanks wow, for sticking with us, chat. <laughs> you guys get all kinds of fun it's stuff that'll be cut, probably cut. Special. We're not sponsored by anything. I don't know what this is, so we'll look at it later. Except Dr. Pepper. Here you go. We're not sponsored by that either. <laughs> <laughs> all right, we are sponsored, however, by Dice Dungeons. Dice Dungeons. Uh, yes. They're yeah. great. Oh, this is a knife. This is their dice. I'm closing it. All right. They're going to have new stuff at the end of this month. So like, They are. Yeah, brand new metal dice. I am. Knives? Yes. All right, guys. Well, we'll get started. Let's start with our three. All right. Having bested the orc. Barely. Yeah. Barely. Panting over his corpse, you do still have the uh, the way out that you came in through the Rimaraz den. Evienne looks to you and says, Well, then, that was easier than I thought it would be. 
Yeah, you did a whole lot of you. <laughs> I'll have you know she put in quite an effort. <laughs> she she, she shot, sure she did. shot somebody. <laughs> she sure did shoot like one person once and then hid in some shadows for like four turns. Uh, <laughs> yeah, she did that. She, she says, really um, she kind of leaned. <laughs> well then, I suppose uh, the orcs would be well on the way to meet the Yavi by now. I would agree. A false flag attack, if it worked, could prove useful to the Hayfork in a council of three holding lords. Mm-hmm. Or it could kill them all. All of the Arbin? If it does, all the better. Right. Well, we left two companions over there. Surely they'll be wise enough to flee. Um, no. One of them might be, yes. <laughs> the other, not so much. A heretic that she is, I don't feel comfortable condemning her to a death along with the hill tribesmen. Somehow I don't think I'm going to like where this conversation is leading. Well, the conversation begins with, you may stay here if that is what you wish. It continues, I will be riding hard for the hill tribe encampment. Well, I don't very well think I'll be staying here in the middle of these uh, cans. I, uh, cairns. I, <laughs> cairns is hard to say in an English accent. Cairns, I'd say. Cairns. Cairns. In the middle of these cairns, I have a hard time <laughs> staying here, I will. Um, I, I don't think I'll be staying here at all. So I suppose I'm left with no choice but to continue with you. The same goes for either of you. You may stay, but I have to go. <clears throat> Alright, just call down your man thing, let's go. <laughs> Gesundheit. Alright. <laughs> and the uh, the ram does indeed... Well, I guess we'll... I'm assuming you're going outside. We'll go outside. Yeah. The ram just busts through the wall. Pineapple! <laughs> uh, <it's> Pineapple! <laughs> really? The ram comes up and we'll, uh, we'll mount up. Uh, yeah. All right. Are you planning right. on going? Or yeah, no? yeah. You're, you're going? Yeah. You got how many spell slots do you have left? Uh, A level two spell slots. Red? Red? I, I have three. Red. I have three spell slots. Or no, four spell slots. I have three first level and then one second level. Do you want to go ahead and just drop a healing spirit on the back of the ram as That's we're okay. just speeding along? I also, I also have uh, 24 health. And yeah, I'm at 19, so I'm just thinking that, that, uh, that healing spirit. Yeah, let's do good. some healing spirits. And... All so, right, you heal yourself up. It's all good. You do that. With what? I don't know. You're My one little... level two spell. Just do it. So or if we're down. sitting still in the healing spirit, it's 10d6, ten, ten right? 10d6, yeah. yeah. For each of us? Yeah. No, total. No, total. total. And not for you. You're not that. <laughs> <laughs> this is on the and back I, of the ram. So I'm along. just walking... Uh, I mean, you could another... just wait for one minute. You can't be on my horse. <sighs> I guess you would be on my horse. Or you could just wait for one minute and yeah. split it up among everyone. You, whatever, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> I guess that sounds 32 fair. between us. That's not much. Yeah. Oh, boy. Okay. Eight health each. Nope. What? That's not right. That's not right. <laughs> I was okay, that's like, no. Right. Another math teacher. Literally. That would be said, 11, 11, and 10. Indeed it would 32. be. 32. Uh, well, 10 goes to Grant. That's obviously... I'll take the 10 because <laughs> I'm pretty high up. All right. Hopefully All right. Uh, and then you set off? I guess I'll also use my pure wounds of myself. That's pretty smart. Level yeah. 2. You could, you could I have no second up. levels. All right, Osborne. Yes, you guys want to take 10 minutes? Well, we could do that on the road. <laughs> well, well, uh, can we do that? What? Could we ritual cast a spell on the in the saddle? I think Prayer of Healing has you like doing candles. I think so, yeah. Oh, so does Prayer it? of yeah. Healing might be That'd a be hard thing. But you, you just can take 10 minutes right before you go. Do you guys want to take 10 minutes for Prayer of Healing? It is 10 minutes. You'll just have to go over the speed of it. I mean, at worst... I only need 10 more At worst, health. they're all dead. Is, is right, what but, but if is. they're all dead after 10 minutes, were you really going to be able to That's help? what I'm about to say. Because that's 100 rounds of combat. We're writing that for a day. Like, a, it's going to take us a day to get there. Is just, ten minutes just really speed. Be... There are no copies. How, <laughs> how many times in the fantasy genre has someone showing up right at that moment made all the difference? Uh, been excuse minutes... me, when Gandalf shows up over the hill coming down... Being and... sarcastic. Oh, okay. <laughs> so what did you get? 46. Okay, cool. What? What's happening? So, are we taking ten minutes for prayer mm, I No. I only need ten. My, my vote is no, but I only have one vote. Cure wounds on myself. Okay. okay. There you go. I Level believe two. in you. I believe in you. Okay. Give it a give it a give it a Oh no, I have I have five points of lay on hands left. I have five points. We'll be okay. You won't be fine. Alright, and you're five, <laughs> five, 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 five points. One roll. It's pretty good roll. Huh? So if you're going fast, what is the um 
the highest passive perception among with, you. With a minus, what is it? With a minus uh, four. Uh, well, mine would be uh, six. Oh, God. So. <laughs> Probably Sam's will be the uh, highest. Yeah, huh? uh, yours might be good. Mine is 14. I think 14, so it would What's be a, a 10. Yours is 13. Yeah. So, not, so 10. 10 is the best we got. I reckon we're just going to want to ride hard. Do I not have a shield on your arm? Yeah, but that's your bonus to perception. Can I it's take just, the die? Oh, wait, there's a gun. Plus three. Don't so you're right. Just every round? It gotcha. would be very exhausting. To do Never what? Mind. Okay. To do what? To just be constantly dodging as he's I'll just, I'll, I'll, I'll have my shield on. <laughs> it's All right. Work. As you ride hard across the land. I'm going to equip needle. Oh, instead of the quarter step. Uh, okay. Okay. As you ride hard across the land, you hear a rumbling in the trees. And in my belly. I'm actually Stepping fast. out in front of you. No. Uh, close enough that you have to I'm wheel okay. the ram and their horse aside to avoid hitting it is a massive ogre. Oh, God! <laughs> As it steps out, it's joined by two others. Two other ogres? You hear movement behind you <clears throat> as ogres come out of the trees behind you as well. I don't have time for this. For out of our way. Four. Uh, I'm going to slam my weapon against my shield and make a okay. check. Uh, can I assist by lifting my hand no, up? No, this you one's can, one he has to do by you, you could guidance me? Can sure. he guidance me? Does he have time for that? You could guidance him. Can I? Yeah! Wait, I'll <laughs> guidance. All guidance? Uh, yeah, that is real good. That is a 19... 25. I could have gone with the big one, but it was just the 15. All so right. I had to make a DC 15 wisdom save. Um, As you're riding, not even slowing down, yeah. you start banging your spear against your yeah. shield. The sunlight reflect, ref, reflecting, reflecting refracting. and refracting off of it yeah. in a million different directions. And riding hard towards this ogre in the center, it jumps out of the way, clearly terrified of anything brave enough to charge an ogre. Good. And turning over your shoulder, you can see the seven ogres behind <laughs> oh you. Oh my <laughs> god! Standing and staring in awe at this sight. That Jesus. Has to. Keep going. Please. We'll, we'll keep riding. We're just, seven I think we're just out of this. All right. Roll me that a was 100. A, Grant. That was, right. a, that was my one of those. I don't get any more of those for another rest. So that that was my get out of ogre free card. Mm. 98. <laughs> hey, high's good. Hey, high's it's Demogorgon. Is high good? High's good. Okay. High's good. No. no other no. way around. Low's good. What? Low's good. God. Every time. <laughs> <laughs> That's real bad. That's real bad. That's bad, Nick. Bad it. Bad it. Almost charts. as bad as you can do. <laughs> Another orc army. <laughs> <laughs> Led by... Yeah. All All right. Right. Led by, like, he Hitler. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's weird. Okay, Feywolf is dead, all right? Um, <laughs> yeah, no, he's not. Is he, though? Yeah, he might currently be. It just probably won't last. So, <clears throat> as you're riding hard... Oh, you no. can see, uh, on their way, the same direction as you, off in the distance, four what look like frost trolls. Why are we huh. just now running into these things? <laughs> four frost trolls. Hey, how does a spider feel? Oh, we really need to get somewhere? Troll. <laughs> Each of them wearing a tabard. Bearing the sigil of the Akar clan. No! Can, can we? Look what you've done. Well, that's not good. Take the long way. Sorry. Take the long way. <laughs> Take a right right now. We'll just, we'll just wheel further away. You, they're far enough away that, that you won't encounter them right now, but it looks right like now. they are headed towards uh-huh. the Take the long way. Well, that's going to be a problem for later. All right. Good. All right. Sorry that I've brought this up. That's going to be a problem for later. No, no, no. It was, uh, that, was, that was our idea. Jointly, we thought it was a grand plan. Not a grant plan. <laughs> that, that's Not a great. I I was against that involves the most video. parts of this point. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, after a day of hard riding, you arrive to see whatever we find out here in a moment. Oh <laughs> oh, 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 we're too late anyway. I don't know. Oh man. We'll find out. We need to find out. So, find out this time on this episode. Arden standing party. with you atop the. Oh, is that yours? Yeah. What is that? Arden, no, stand. It's, it's people dog. chatting. Nope. Stand. Oh, it's, it's a, a dog. dog. Standing with you atop the. Uh, like a dog. Atop the, the gate to the east that overlooks the War Games area is watching the orcs array themselves in an army. Up here with you guys. Once more, the orc riding atop the woolly rhino 
holds out his hand, and a finger is touched to his hand by a witch. And he, uh, he bellows, I see you, Dark Elf. <laughs> and you, Priestess. It has been a long time. <laughs> We've learned quite a lot from that book of yours. <laughs> and you can see now <laughs> that the, the witch is holding that book Where is he? under his arm. He's, he's, he's way over there. there. He's way over there. I won't do anything. Um, <laughs> I'm going to throw a rock at him. I'm to throw an axe just in the general direction. Uh, he says, Too far. I assume your dwarf friend is there as well. I look forward to beating yeah. him once more. Yeah, he's here. He probably can. He's here. I assume also. Oh, uh, yeah. They're all, everyone is here. I assume also that you had something to do with sending the Yarbeer to attack us. What? What? Uh, of course not. Arden looks over to you and he says, They attacked him. I didn't send any men. Nor did we. We do not have any any sway with the Arbeer to uh, have them go on an expedition. Nice. Hmm. I don't like this. That, that was us wearing for He awesome. shouts out. If you were attacked by Yarbeer, they were rogues. Not one of ours. Yeah. Well, I have no quarrel with you. A car. And uh, he says... Perhaps not, but you have brought quarrel upon yourselves. Oh, yeah. Come, face me in the field. I assume you speak for your people. We shall battle as champions as the Solmathi do. <laughs> kind Man. of a bummer that we sent off Bear Guy. Sure is. Uh. Arden uh, looks around and you can see several of the Yarbeer are now looking to him, expecting him to do this. Uh, and for a moment, his cool veneer is broken. Uh, and you can see he's a bit worried. <laughs> <laughs> um, he, uh, he looks to his people and then back out over the field. And to a car, he shouts, I'm not so much a fool to trust an orc. Were I to meet you in honorable combat, those archers up on the hills, or perhaps those ogres with their big rocks, would strike me down before I ever even reached you. No. Every man knows you don't trust an orc. <laughs> and all the yarbeers start going, Ahai! Bring them down! Kill them! All of them! Ah, shouting, Rabble, rabble, rabble! I'm grabbing cat. Um, I figured. He looks to you and he says, uh, he says, you have a plan for dealing with these? Heat them <laughs> harder than they hit us and soon. All right. I'm going to try to have some of my men move up onto that ridge there. And he gestures off to the ridge. He says, uh, the key to our battle strategy will be to keep them in the war games field. If they break through our line and into the gate, too many of our people will die. I'm not going to allow that. I don't I don't intend to lose this battle. And your friends? Hopefully they will return in time. Hopefully they'll return at all. <laughs> Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully. Hopefully. Depends on how many more cross trolls. A car um says if you will not meet me, then you are a coward, Yarbeer. Very well. We will do battle. Soon. And the rhino turns and sort of heads back towards the siege camp that you can see they're setting up now. Okay. All right. Um, All right. And it That's looks fine. like, as the sun is starting to set, it looks like uh, they're preparing to send out some forces. Arden says... They'll likely be waiting until the, the sun has fallen all the way. Everybody knows orcs are stronger in the dark. The moon gives them power. Hmm. <laughs> and their ability to see in that dark is likely quite an advantage they would like to exploit. Aye, under the powers <clears throat> of the moon. Right. Yes. <laughs> 
Ah, you are an idiot. <laughs> I see I have made a grave error. <laughs> Should have chosen the bear. <laughs> Hey, he, he's not wrong. He yeah. just uh, he just misunderstands what makes them better in the dark. Right, definitely. Uh, it's just physiology it and, not, that way. and not the moon. <laughs> oh, magnets. Can't find an orc on Tuesday because magnets. Oh. Uh, he says uh, we'll need to repair. I'll have archers up on the edge, and uh, men in the trees. I'll hopefully have some men. Sneaking around to hit their back line. We'll keep their attention focused here while I send my best troops to attack their flank. Most of our forces will array right here at the War Games field. Of course, I'll split some of our defence so that they're on the other side just in case they try to come in the other gate and up on the hill so that they can't jump down into the camp. If any orc enters Lythri, it's over. And mm. this place is very important to my people. It's holy ground. And those who are not invited are not to enter. Any orc comes close to the gate, you cut him down. Honoured as we are by our, by our invitation, we will do everything we can to protect this field. Good. There's a speck to be earned here today. And it's yours, but only if you take it. My people don't give their respect lightly. We can win this. They outnumber us, but we have the advantage here. They'll have to be coming through that terrain. It will give them cover, but it also means we'll have men waiting there to fight. Uh, he gestures off to the tower in the center there. He says, we don't want any of their spellcasters to get up there. If one of their priests is on top of that tower, he'll have a clear line of sight across the field. That'll give them some good advantage. That would be the first place I'd recommend <coughs> taking. <coughs> Uh, he calls up some men, and he, he looks at them and he says, These two here, they fought the orcs before. They know their tactics. I'm going to be taking my, uh, my best strike force to hit them in the flank. Meanwhile, these two will be in charge of the defense up here. You have to follow them and follow their orders. You understand? And all the men nod oh, no. and clasp a uh, fist <laughs> in their heart quickly. Oh, no. uh, he says... <laughs> They'll expect me to be coming up the center. That's where they'll be looking for me. They know how the Yarbia work. We're close enough you know, to their kind. If they were to take me out, they know that that would break morale. So I won't give them the opportunity. They might kill me, but not in front of my men. My best men will follow me. We'll head to the flank. We'll hit them in the back. I'll see if I can take out as many of their spellcasters as I can. That's going to be the advantage that we can't match. We don't have very many of those. Uh, he says, <laughs> and he says <coughs> that said, many of them we, can we do have one shaman that uh, is skilled in battle. Relic. And uh, a man steps forward and he says, Relic, you have to follow the wizard here. He'll, uh, he'll lead you. Do whatever you can to keep our men alive and working. And if you can get that tower, do so. Um, he looks to you and he says... Uh, I need to start gathering my, th my troops. We'll need to move quickly and quietly. Do you have this? We have this. I'm putting a lot of faith in you here. Don't betray that faith. It is well placed, I assure you. All right. <laughs> and what's that book that they said they have? Oh, that's me. Uh, I look to him, and I sort of pull him aside, because I don't want other people to hear this. And uh, I tell him that um, if he gets a chance to, to use the book as it's written, this battle will be over even before they enter the gate. We mustn't let him do that. All right. Well then, we'll have to stop him. He's sticking pretty close to Garku, right in the center of their lines. I, I don't know if I'll be able to get my forces there. But perhaps you've got something I don't. We'll see what happens. But right now, at best, he's second priority for us. <laughs> uh, he says... Uh, not for you, he's not. He says, I'm also seeing a lot of war beasts. It couldn't hurt to send out scouts, but if we do, they might not come back. Your thoughts? <laughs> What's the point of the scout? <laughs> well, to, see, to see... Well, they have a bunch of war beasts. <clears throat> he says... Uh, 
He says, most of their forces are concealed back there in the tree line. It would be helpful to us to know exactly what we're dealing with. Mm-hmm. Maybe if there were already a tree there that could listen. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I told you to stay. We're you busy. wanted to go with them. We would have definitely died had you not been there. That's true. Uh, the orcs will be alert and waiting for something like scouts. Yeah. I agree. But any battle is one on its intelligence. I cannot disagree with that, I suppose. If you have stealthy scouts who could go in undetected, that would be the best way. I have them. I have them. I'm not sure if I want to risk them. I heard wizards have an ability to, to send creatures ahead of them and see through their eyes. Do you have anything like that? I do, though its range is limited. I would have to be in earshot, roughly. And you said you were able to, to get into the dreams of, of one of the of a, a fiaker. Yes. I heard a tale of, of two pirates who would, who would use dreams to communicate at great distances across the sea. Mm. Could, could you do that? I am afraid I am not quite that skilled as a wizard myself. All right. Good idea. <laughs> <laughs> <Have> his hand. <laughs> I'm in favour of knowing what we're up against, but... The men would be coming off of your defences up here. Is it worth it to you? We can defend the... Uh, yes. Okay. <laughs> I will probably die. Uh, <laughs> then I'll send the scouts out. Good luck to you. And to you as well. Alright, he leaves. So, I need each of the four of you to roll me a d4. Oh boy. Oh. One. I'm just right now. Four. Okay. Four. Tres. I got a one. Oh, one? Okay. So, one of your scouts was killed. Oh, no. no. However, most of the scouts made it back alive. That's good. That is very good. About an hour later, the scouts return. As you can see, the orc force is starting to mobilize. The scouts run through the field ahead, arrows peppering behind them. Um, and one of the scouts uh, gets to the gate and starts banging on it and says, Open the gate! Open it! And uh, you can see one of your guys up there hoisting or turning the wheel as, it, as the gate starts to open. Uh, and the scouts run inside and the gates close behind them. Uh, panting, he looks up and he says, They've got... They, they're not just... Not just orcs. They've got other things too. They have a cave troll. I heard I heard them say that there's trolls on the way. They've also got ogres. Ogres in armor with spears. Ooh. How are we possibly says, gonna do this? He says uh he says wolves. Too. Wolves and and shamans, pikemen. And two captains under Garkul's command. It looks like they caught some of the manticores that lives in the hills. <laughs> oh my god. We're so dead. <laughs> so this will be unbelievable. This will be a well earned victory. But that's not it. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's fences. I overheard something while we were there. While we were there. They're planning on sending archers in, mounted on aurochs. But the worst part, they have that book. Yep. And yep. I heard them say two things. One, they mentioned that they're going to be sending some, some of their dead that they've brought with them, rigged to explode. <laughs> If you see a corpse moving, I'd kill that one first. And I'd kill it from a distance. But, the other thing they said, <laughs> when one of the orcs asked what would happen if, if more of them die, the shaman said that, that 
he'd, he'd combine their spirits into a greater spirit. A minor god, he called it. He really had to not let he'd, this... Um, he'd bring it together into a great beast. A beast of the dead. I'm going to flip this table. <laughs> no way we're going to win. I tried to not like, let the book get away, but I okay. almost died the first we, time. We've, we've got a challenge ahead. <sighs> that we do. I think that's more than just a challenge. Thank you for your work. We can handle it, just me and you, we can do it. So I got a bow and axes. I'm, all good. I'm beginning the... to think more and more and more that the three of us are just arriving to an absolute slaughter. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> there's, there's one entire finger still intact. I think that one might have been esteemed probably. Right. It's just inchworming so across. Would, and then would the Yarbeer be vehemently opposed to burning this? No, not necessarily. Okay. Uh, but if you burn that, and remember, they want to keep people away from this. So if you burn that, that means that you'll be fighting in an open field. So... Right. Yeah. It would take a while for it to burn entirely. Yeah, you I mean, like, but just a little more a so that yeah. we can see. Yeah, I mean, I think this is well, the others that can they see. had to set up like for this Definitely challenge. burn that, because they don't want spellcasters going yeah, there. Yeah, set no. that on fire. I right feel like now. it'd be good to set it on fire when, when the battle it. starts. Here's what would happen if you burned it, because it would be burning pretty much throughout the battle. It wouldn't yeah. burn down. Oh, yeah. So it would make it more destructible. And it would cause smoke to surround each of them, which would uh, give uh, heavily obscured uh, right. from one side to the other. For sure. Which is fine, because they have lots yeah. of archers. Yeah. Granted, right. so do you. But they could also but get But you can just be training right here and go, all right, if you see a guy, neck him. shoot that guy. It will take them at the hut gates where numbers count for nothing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I think as far as burning down the whole thing, I didn't think that'd be super good for us. You should probably wait but... till people like, start to... Yeah, I would, right. So I think we would. We should try to have. Can they like use? I have a lot. Could, Unless you want could the archers there. we have prepare like burning arrows? Yeah, they could. I think we should have. And them you can you guys on the ridge do that? Can they prepare? That'd be good. Can they pair, prepare drums of oil? Drums of oil. They don't have like a, yeah, that sounds like a, a lot. ton of oil or pitch because they don't use it for much. They don't really use oil lanterns. They mostly just use bonfires. Okay. Mm. Then I guess yeah. just, but they would have had if they want, you could do you could do like proof. bundles yeah, of, of uh, uh, dry wood. What water. you could also do um, is uh, several of the yard beer are willing to do whatever you like as far as uh, if you've got one hour as far as digging trenches. Um, oh yeah, burning down Ogres stuff, trip and fall. cutting a tree, whatever you want to do, uh, trying to lay traps. So I'm gonna let you discuss what you'd like to do uh, while I run to the restroom real quick. Nice. What do you want to do? Well, um, I think it'd be good to, to lay some traps at what if you certain did, points. What if you did kind of like the last samurai thing where this last ditch effort, these two uh, walls right here, light those on fire so it creates a smoke screen and flame screen from anyone coming in. And you, what you could do is just make a fence go to the wall, fence go to that wall, and now they have to bottleneck through. Yeah, see, my thinking Let's was we could we could do that. Yeah, I was thinking we could just put like pits on either side. Well, I guess they get trees Spike there. Traps. Spike traps. Yeah, that'd be take a little more time, I think. No, you just <laughs> dig it. Just dig, build a wall across the whole entrance. Trench, and then just, just yeah, put just put spikes. How will steal wall? No exactly. problem. <laughs> exactly. We'll, we'll make Mexico pay for it. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> this is an apolitical hey, production. Hey, orcs, would you mind building Yeah, hey, orcs, can you build the wall for us? <laughs> so, Fantastic. yeah, I like trenches. Yeah, we can, like, put, like, spears or Yeah, yeah, that sounds like, good. And they've got lots of those. So, like, like, they like there and across here cards. would be good. Can you... I reckon I'm going to want to spend Bobby, where is your tomacos? <laughs> She's German yes. now, Corby. Yeah, yeah, I'm wondering. Corby, like, may I have your pots? Thank you, Doctor. We have an hour, but like, how long does it take to do that? Oh, uh, lockers. Where is the uh, whole pastry oh. things? Wow. Well, I, I, I put them away because I was eating all of them. Is red okay on uh, this? No. Red is bad. Red is bad. Black is good. So we only have black pretty much because I know red, red is, is dead. Gross. Uh, can you give him the pastries? Who? Grant. Oh yeah, I want like a couple. The, the they're crazy. Hold on, I'm over there. They're very good. good. I'm, I'm gonna try. Them. They're very, very good. Is, is they're the, real good. This this particular little feller. Ah. I've not had a, has a, chocolate a cinnamon on one. Is this cinnamon? Yeah, it's cinnamon. I like this 
cinnamon ones. Hmm. Cinnamon one's pretty good too. Yeah, that's um, that's that's stupid good. Okay. Nice. Does anybody else want? So good. Good job, Haley. I've had a cinnamon one. I'll get one. I'll get a cinnamon one. Good job, Haley. Good job, Haley. Good job, Haley. Good Very yummy. Not me, Haley. Yeah. Haley, that sucks. Oh. See the other one. I didn't do it. You gotta have sound effects when you draw. It's important. It is important. Maybe do a little one right here, too, in case you try to go around that way. So you just build Guys, you only have an hour. Yeah, but there's a there's lot, a of, lot of us we to have a lot dig of holes. Yeah, easy. Dig a tunnel, dig, dig a tunnel, dig a tunnel. Yeah, dig if I uh, if I wasn't able to get a short rest before this whole deal oh, happened, it might be effective for me to uh, do that before we. Um, oh, that's true. Get started. Oh, you yeah. get a rest and we don't. Right, no, that's cool. that's fair. I, I need, need some good, slots. That makes sense for the wizard. You <laughs> need some slots. It makes sense for the wizard to want to have as much boom as he can as he can manage. Oh, Speaking of that, lot. what boom have you prepped today, sir? Well, what what you got? Let's, let's hear your spell. Please. Please. I do have please. I have lightning bolt. No, he, he chain lightning is like lightning super high. Level. <laughs> yeah. But I have lightning bolt, which is basically that, only not please. at all. <laughs> um, in the sense that it is lightning. I have a cool spell that I plan to use to break the phalanx, but I don't think they're going to be using that today. Which mm-hmm. is concerning because it's pretty single target. Yeah. Sickening radiance would have been We're cool. We're digging holes. No. Okay. We dig holes and then put like like spears and stuff in them. Okay. So if they fell in, they we did okay. that one so and that, that one, there. and we dig a hole here. Are you using an old? Weapon? I am because I couldn't find your good ones. Look at that! They're just on the right, floor. right there. Right there. Line of sight. <laughs> it's because your specs are on your head instead of on your face. Well, you know. So, uh, Colby, would I have had uh, time. any time to have had a short rest before this all went down? Yeah, you could have. Well, I mean, you could be resting while they're That's digging. What saying. That's yeah. what I was hoping for, because, yeah, I could use a little, uh, should little we, spell slot. Should we do song. one over there, too? No. Yeah. Bottleneck it between Because he could areas. still be talking to them while he's. You get four levels of short slots. rest, because it's not like he naps anywhere. You've got three more squares if you want to do it, that you can do in this time. <clears throat> nice. All right. <clears throat> All right, so you've basically now got two directions that they can come from. They can come... No, that's that's pretty that's pretty definitive. Mm-hmm. They can come straight on at you, or, or they, they can, can hop that hole. It. So I think it'd be effective to burn that tower and this wall mm-hmm. so we can get some smoke going okay. so they don't know those pits are there. Okay. Do you want to start burning them while the pits are being dug, basically? Um, How long would you think probably it would right take them to burn? Okay. Okay, and we'll start start the burning on this end. Okay. But of course. It but of course. Do we know about uh, oh, the wolf how the uh, wind's going? Well, the, the wind, happen. because you're in the uh, valley, oh, okay. it, it really kind of goes this way. Gotcha. Um, That's handy. Mm-hmm. And which one? No. This tower? No, it's not. Uh, yeah. Well, because now the that I'm about it, shooting so, into if the wind. wind's going that way, well, yeah, I don't think we're going to have more burning with those dynamics. Might just do this wall then. Okay, well that will spread to the tower because it's all connected. Oh, okay, well just the tower's fine. Okay. Yeah, and then the rest of the wall can go with it. And then also their archers have wind to support their right. arrows. Yeah, but I don't, I don't think we're going to mess with aerodynamics on arrows. Are you sure? <laughs> aerodynamics, indeed. If you will. I might. I may. He, he won't. Evidently, he's And we're, we're going to we're gonna light that. We're going to have some guys ready to do that when okay. somebody, when they look, when they, uh, get, when. If somebody gets in there. Okay, cool. Basically, yeah. All right. Don't you All of you, this? even those who aren't here, can place your yard beer wherever you like on the field. Cool. Well, these are my two yard beer. <coughs> yeah. <coughs> and my me. Uh, so my me is not here. Mm. Oh, you also. Right about there. Right about there. Oh, is that your uh, your your shaman? Yeah. Shaman feller? Left over from the war games. Uh, you oh. do have uh, more. Uh, oh. s- smaller barricades that you can set up as you like. Get that one. Oh, nice. And so these are just uh, stored that weren't used in the war nice. games. You can place these wherever you like. That's not bad. You have another one of those little foot things? Let's put those up on oh, the hill. What kind? The little, little wood uh, stone wall foot wood? things. Wood? Stone wall. Stone wall? No, no, put it on the cliff. There you go. Why? I want to protect our archers up there. We're pretty much all these guys in teams of two. Oh, Lingy. Linger and Lush. Come here. 
What's up? We're going to want these guys in teams of two as often as we can because they have pack tactics. Unfortunately, Haley lost one, I guess. Is that where? Yeah. Yeah, one of her scouts. Her fellow. Dad. Sead State of Affairs. Oh, damn. I wouldn't project them at. Like oh, that. Yeah. Hey, Colby, I have three uh, inspiration points. I'd like to catch my three coppers. Three right coppers? Mm-hmm. I feel like hey, Colby, I wish I had four. I can, can I get a platinum? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, for sure. Are they any... Did you oh, cast the wish on an occasion? Oh, okay, good. Perfect. Uh, I wish for ten platinum cards. <laughs> Colby, I cast cool. wish. Could I have the deck of platinum cards? That's what you're, you're sure. That'd be pretty good. <laughs> That's exactly what I would wish that, for. That'd be all right. really? wish, yeah. They're all going to work the opposite. Of course. Yeah. Because wish. Your character has a deck. They contain the likenesses of all of the platinum cards. Yeah. <laughs> you are a doofus. Uh, is that where those are going? It's not quite as bad as Ellen wishing. I wish there was a what if, dragon what if you, here. What if you put it right here? I wish I had a keep dragon, dragon, dragon right. friend. So all they have to do is focus on going that way. Isn't that the one that ate my sword? Yep. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah. <laughs> and then Boar died to it, and then we got him back just barely. It was close. All right. That's all right. There's some rubble. My sword needed okay, to go so there, though. Okay, so the drawn barricades are full height. They're, like, higher than a man. The barricades on the map that you've placed are, are the same height they yeah. are. Oh. So they're, like, half covered. Okay. So they're lower barricades than the others. Right. But it would still be move, it would move still these take guys closer to the Oh yeah, spot. I mean they have to they have to, to jump over. Yeah. No, against that against the one that spotted. Oh, oh, there that's, you go. that's where they were. <laughs> he was okay. like they sticking were, out though. Oh, yeah. okay. They were like you needed him flush in these with... two squares, not no, on the side of the wall. No, you can be flush with that wall. Be flush with the wall. All right, I'm flush it's with squeezing. the wall. All right, flush. So it's not even squeezing. If you guys arrive, your yard beer will act on your turn. That is right after you. If, if it's good. If you don't arrive, and until you arrive, all of your yard beer will act right after Nick's turn. Okay. All right. Can I give him bless from afar? Or guidance from afar? <laughs> I think it's 30 no. feet. Uh, no, guidance, I think, is touch. Yeah, it is. Bless is 30 feet. Yeah. Okay, cool. <laughs> Are you ready? No. No. <laughs> no. 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 We can't yeah. be. Can we have that? <clears throat> what? The you, you don't, you don't want that. Is on, this, our, on our side. Is no. this a tower? It would not be on our side. Yeah, that we, is. Where can I'm going to be on that. No are there like... Uh, here, I'll, I'll mark some heights. Are there any battlements on that? Or is it just... It's like just that? like posts, but yeah, it gives you half cover. I'll take it. So basically, this wall here is 10 feet high. This is 20 feet high. 20 feet, and then here in the center is 15 feet. Are we allowed to take average damage? On on your guys? Yep. Oh, uh, yeah, that's okay. Okay. That's 10 feet. All, all of this stuff is 10 feet. It's just less rolling oh. that we have to do. That's, that's true. It's 20 feet. Oh, I don't want it. And 8 is pretty good. Yeah. It's question. average. Question, yeah. question, question. So is this the only, these are the only stairs down, and then you go out over oh. here? There's some yeah. my dice. I just is I just block things closed? on the map. It is currently hard work. So if I stayed up here, I'd have to be up here, right? Right. Are you going? You're going to be down amidst the uh, the chaos. You can back back up that dude. Where yeah, you could. Where, so he can get his advantage. I? I don't know. You're right there. I think I might be up here. Oh, okay. Ooh. Oh, and that ridge, by the you, way. You are a highly this, mobile this combatant now. now. So this ridge. So yeah, up to this level of the ridge. <laughs> what the <laughs> take that, Haley. Where'd the good one go? Um, oh, here we go. This level of the ridge is up 15 feet. This level that you're up uh, from this end, <laughs> it's 20 close. feet. Stop touching Over her. Over to baby. where you are is 30 feet. <laughs> oh, she can jump down from there, no problem. Gross! Cooties. Stop it! Don't spread your PDA! I oh, know. All right. Are we ready? No. Uh, yeah, sure. Yeah, very mature group that we all are. Ugh. <laughs> Jeez. Growl. No. We're, we're all, we're all, we're all we're 60 feet die. from me. One, two, three, four. Remember that time on Sunday when Nick just meowed at like nothing? <laughs> yes. 
There was a, I thought there was a cat too. There was a I shadow that moved. And Nick just meow. Yeah, I didn't, there was nothing there. I think it was Scott's foot that I saw. <laughs> I don't oh, remember no. that. Really? Oh man. I mean, you I don't think I noticed of, that. You were on the other side of me, so oh, there's very little chance you could have seen the yeah. thing. Here, make Haley take. Oh yeah, there you go, camera. There's the box. Hey, Look at box those of cookies. cookies. Y'all can't have them. They're ours. Meow. Yeah, there goes Nick meowing at cookies Thanks. again. There's Compact yourselves, on. guys. Compact yourselves. All right. Like, you don't need this. Put this somewhere. It looks as though the battle is joined. As you see, Garkul raise a hand, and the guy next to him raises along a post a red flag that starts flapping in the wind. As he does so, you hear the orcs cry out, And you hear, boom, 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 boom. And coming running down uh, into the valley, you see two squads of scouts led by wolves. These are just scouts, yeah. Roll. You have a longbow, right? That's why I want to see nice little. Don't even roll. Don't even roll. We just basically roll for us. You can do it. Five. No! Why didn't you port it? Why? I did. 23. Oh, that's <laughs> important. Hold on to it, though. Mm. Be good. All right. For one save. Okay. You I. Okay. Mm. Longbow with the ready, you can see okay. some of the scouts move into range. Longbow was at the ready. Okay, here we go. Uh, I am going to shoot a doggo. All right. <gasps> shoot that doggo. How dare you? No, no, no. Go, dare away. You go, girl. Shoot that doggo. Wow. What okay. did that dog do 16? to you? 16? That approached in a hostile okay. what about... Seven plus six. Thirteen. 13. That'll hit. Nice. Shoot that doggo. I hit the doggos. I think I know what their okay, dex so is. So eight, nine, <laughs> 12, plus Natural. ten, twenty-four for two hits on the doggo. Boom. All right. So, sorry, booster. This kills the doggo. Your arrows flying forward. Both pierce the dog's <laughs> side. You did. As the wolf <laughs> with a howl <laughs> rolls across the ground. I think what we're going to do for this fight... No. I can just leave things oh. knocked over. No, let's not do that. I think that's a great idea. Why? All right. Yeah, you know what would be good is that's when you get here and you could be like, Sick flame, go away. No, stop <laughs> it. You didn't know. This is bad. All right. May you rest in peace. That puts Holy us me. at the wolves. Wolf. This wolf uh, is going to dash forward oh, 80 feet. Whoa, mm-hmm. Holy crap. How many squares is that? Uh, 16. Uh, yeah, so or he can gonna, be within range of that dude. He's gonna go within range of that dude. He's gonna harass around the wall. Hashtag a All right. As he does so, he goes running around the wall towards the scent of these two uh, two yarbeer waiting there. As the the fire crackles behind, and he's going to leap at one of Whoa. the yarbeer with a twenty to hit. Even, wow. even after a dash. Yeah. Oh, he, he, he dashed. can't do it. He dashed, yeah. guys. Come on, he dashed. <laughs> All right, the scout. The average guy. The scouts come moving in now. <laughs> Sorry about the doggo. He's gonna come to, to here, and he's gonna come to here. Oh, are they dashing too? These two scouts, I'll they say. are. Uh, all, all of these guys are. And then these are gonna go. And these guys. Yeah, they're gonna dash as well. Oh boy. To here. Oh boy. Them dashing over to here. Oh boy. Alright, so the scouts start moving up and forming a line, and as they do, their javelins at the ready, they start moving in formation. Then, the scout commanders are going to move in, and he is going to move. So he pop, takes pop, up his yeah, pop, 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 <laughs> I just had an image of the actual guy just <laughs> juddering <laughs> crazily across. He's <laughs> 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 like bunny hopping yeah. the whole thing. <laughs> All right. And both of the scout commanders take cover behind walls as they move forward. That's what I'm doing. Like, like carbonite. <laughs> solo from Lego On your belly. Yeah. Just hopping. Bup, 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 bup. Which puts us... Oh, they're not dead, though. At a scheme. No, oh, that's me. Oh, yay! Well, uh, as my action, I'm going to cast uh, a new spell called Death March. Okay. So this spell oh. conjures uh, an incorporeal uh, undead drummer. 
Okay. Pum, uh, rum, 60 pum, feet. Pum. And I can move him as a bonus action. Oh, right. look at him! Is that 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, 10, 11, so what's he do? Uh, he right do? now, that's all he's do. He, he, he is do. playing his his groom. But he's he's a spectral spectral. He, he is. He's a skelly bones oh. that you can't touch. Oh, okay, good. He's an untouchable yes, skelly bones. Incorporeal. And then are you just gonna like hit the deck or something so they can't shoot it shoot shoot you in the um, face? Um, you know that's not a bad idea. What are you gonna do with Did him? You not want to move your yard? Oh, I'm gonna do something with him. I Can you really cast through him? Sister. Unfortunately, no. That would be pretty sick. That's that would so be sick. good. Uh, I think I will, uh, yeah, crouch down behind the wall so that I'm right. hidden in. And do you want to move your yard view? Oh yeah, I forgot to do that. Um, Which ones are those? Are those yours? These are mine. Well, you should have. I think he's gonna. I, that's the point. He's gonna cast. Um, our yard beer, uh, uh, can cast? we just go boom? boom yeah, he's, boom. Like, he's a he's a priest. Sure, can do Nick. stuff like that. Just keep the circle. Yeah. Well, uh, I guess he's gonna cast bark skin and then. Okay, sounds good. And then hang out. Your yard beer. Uh, staying where they are. Okay. But they're gonna ready in action. Anyone who comes around left corner, not right, left corner. Your left, left here. Corner. Yes, right okay. there. Anyone who comes around is gonna get an axe immediately to the brain. All right, nice. Uh, Grant, your yard beer. Uh, this yard beer is going to move around and get a flank to the other side of the right. dog. And they do have pack tactics. They are going yeah. to both... Um, I'm just going to... We said we could take yeah. average damage. Totally, totally. Right? Okay. Yeah, just roll the hit and we can do that. And they each have one attack per turn? One attack, yeah. Okay. So the first yard beer, they're going to like strike as one. Um, the first yard beer... 14. 14 will hit. All right. And the second... Uh, mm. Uh, 12? 12 will not do it. Ah. So, there you go. so the nice first gauge. steps into position and starts swinging, distracting the dog. As the second comes overhead, his falchion held high and cleaves down into it, uh, cutting into the dog's back for 8 slashing damage. Gotcha. All right. Yeah. That puts us then at your yard. Not uh, they're going to both lean around the wall and use uh, a skill that's not listed there, but I assume they have. They're going to throw a rock. Okay. Uh, so both of them are going to do do that. So All right. They have advantage. Yeah, so but picking also, up rocks, they start chunking them. But would you estimate they have disadvantage? Yeah, so it, it just right, goes so have two attacks that are both at regular. Yeah. One is and a, I will say the range on that would probably only be about 60, uh, even in disadvantage range. Well, they're imminent, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, dog. gotcha. Okay. Yeah. That's, that's what's, what's going on. So one stepping is, around the wall, they start pelting the dog with 15. rocks. That'll hit. All right. And one is no. Isn't it? Uh, and so that's... What? It's 25, right? Yeah. And so that's just going to be two damage. Two damage? Uh, oh, I would assume. Is a rock just one, or can I roll a d4? Uh, it's going to be one. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> it's so just a little it's rock. two damage total. So pelting the dog with rocks, uh, mm-hmm. you can see the dog start to, to flinch as it's hit from two sides now. Give him hell! And then they're going to lean back behind and retake their position. All right. They're supposed to be guarding this. And that makes it that dog's turn as he pounces upward at uh, one of the Yarbeer next to him. Okay. For 22 to hit? Yep. Wow! All right. Wow. Who's uh, your beer? Are those are those Sam's. Yep. Okay. Cool. For nine piercing damage. Sure wow. I should write this down. And the target needs to make a strength save. Uh oh. So you are. Uh, yeah. yeah. That's good. All right. It leaps up, trying to knock him over, and that yard beer catches him on the blade of his falchion and starts fighting against him until kneeing him in the stomach. The dog tumbles backward. Nice. Take that dog. That puts us at the orc scouts. Can they see this guy? Okay. Yeah. Oh, oh, he's okay. there. Yeah, he's visible. So, so he's visible. Yeah, but he's yeah. just a big, scary, but they can't do anything. Jumper boy. Well, they don't yeah. know that yet. Right, but but that's what I'm saying is they <laughs> yeah. can't hurt him. Yeah. So uh, these two are moving forward and they start wrong? slashing into him, uh, wow. or they take their javelins and they they lower weapons and jab no from two honor. sides, seeing nothing can happen. Uh, they turn and they bark something in orcish at these guys. That's uh, indecipherable from this range. And these two are now going to leap over this wall. <laughs> they're about to get cleaved in half. That's where I think. Alright, and then they're going to dash. Oh, what a bunch of turds. He gets cleaved. Alright. Yep. No advantage, I'm afraid. Why not? He doesn't have an ally within five feet of that guy. Oh, uh, you got a point. 
Nope. All right. So uh, the orc came around way too fast, and he hits the <laughs> bins and pulls. All right. Yeah, the uh, orc ducks down underneath the, the swing, second. tumbling through the uh, through the grass and the snow. And this guy uh, is going to, I think, stay put for now. Uh, oh well, it's not his turn. So these scouts over here. <laughs> so yes, he's definitely yes, staying put. All right. So they're gonna dash so that they can leap over the wall here, and then they can go two more. So they're gonna get to there. The Yarbeer hear boots on the snow behind them as they're battling this wolf. Uh-oh. And oh, and then those guys. Yeah, those dudes. When does the Yarbeer uh, wizard boy get a turn? Oh, bummer. He already did. He, he did. Yeah. yeah. He just couldn't the do it. Yarbeer wizard boy. Sure. Oh, yeah, my fellas have some, some stuff to deal with. I was going right. to rush over and engage, but... And that puts us then, all of the orcs dash, so it puts us at the uh, the battle criers, the scout sergeants, and the battle criers, let's see what they've got. Did you not do anything on your turn? I did. She, she oh. killed a wolf. Oh, that's right, yeah, you shot the doggo. All right, it's steam. The battle that. criers are going to stay there. <clears throat> okay, well, as a bonus action, uh, I'm going to have this fella... Scooch on. Would you say he can move through them as an incorporate? He's incorporate. Oh, yeah. So he's gonna scooch on forward a little more, uh, come up right up to this dude, finish his cadence, and explode. Oh, <laughs> cool! All right. So, what happens? so those three need to make dexterity saving throws. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Rum pum pum pum. Boom. <laughs> Uh, so the battle card got a 14. Okay, that's going to fail. And the scouts got 16 and 2. Okay, the 16 passes. Okay. And so each of them, uh, we have 12, 18. So the failures are going to take 18 fire damage. So one of the scouts is incinerated. Foosh. And the... Uh, would you say that his body is still there? Or is he for the, burned for the pretty, sake of, pretty bad. He'll still be there for He'll still be there, okay. Uh, and the success will be 9 damage. Night fire okay. Uh, that was a free thing that I get to do whenever I want it to. Nice. But the bonus nice. action is to move it. So I'm going to get up and I think go ahead and <laughs> cast me uh, an Enduring Missiles. All right. So that was that spell I was telling you about beforehand. Yeah. This is a basically magic missile, but uh, it does 1d6 plus 1 force damage per missile. Uh, there are three of them, and they return to me at the end of my turn. All right. Uh, then as a bonus action on subsequent turns, I can make them do that again. Uh, I'm going to have them pelt this dude. Okay. <laughs> Swing. <around. laughs> uh, so that's going to... Woo! He might not make it through this. That's a uh, 13... So 16 force damage. All right. On and as brother. soon as the smoke clears from the uh, explosion of the drummer, uh, he looks up to see you extending your finger and three darts pepper him. Whoosh. And he is killed. He is yeah. killed. Yeah. Get rocked. All right. Punk. That puts us... At some your beers, too. At, uh, yeah, your beer. Mine. Um, he's going to your, your beer, take your an attack of opportunity. He's going to go to help his friend over there, try to duck underneath the door. So he, he can door. take an off attack. All right, which one? That one there? All right, yeah. cool. Uh, and he... Taking his dagger, plunges it into that guy's back, but he only got a 13. So nope. I think that your is good. Um, does 11 hit? 11? Yeah. On the orc? Yeah. No. So the guy that disengaged missed, and then the one hit. What? That's it. That looks that like blue one's cocked. Yeah, They're both right. cocked. Okay. Try try again. There yeah, that's go. a good hit. 20. All right. Takes All right, you got eight it. Eight slashing damage. Eight? Yeah. Pretty good. All right, nice. Pretty good. Uh, all right, anybody else uh, yet next to your beer? That's uh, it's me. Uh, so the first one is going to try. Uh, I'll say it's. Uh, I'll say it's this guy. Okay. He's gonna try and finish off that dog that just leaped up onto him. All right. Oh, that's wow. Whatever. Um, fourteen will hit, right? All right. Yeah. As he's grappling with the dog, the dog having its its jaws clamped around the falchion, yeah. he takes his falchion and just slashes, cutting Ugh. straight through the dog's oh, uh, nice. inside his mouth. Ugh. As it tumbles back, he kicks oh. it against the wall. Uh, where it's splintered against one of the support spikes. Ooh. Gotcha. All right, and then, uh, like seeing that the dog is now dead, uh, they will turn to the orcs that have just arrived. All right. Uh, and they're, this guy's going to attack that All one, right. so they still have advantage. 
Um, how does a 22 treat? 22 will hit. All right. Probably so eight more hurt. damage. Uh, these guys are the scouts that you encountered in Aberdubby. Oh, some okay. of them might even be some of the very same yeah. scouts so they're you not, bought. They're not heavily. Uh, no, they're just wearing studied, studded leather. Studied leather. Studied leather. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> they're right crafty, All agile right. What you got? Uh, Eight damage to that guy. Eight damage to that guy? Yeah. Okay, cool. <laughs> All right. Um, your your right. Uh, my guys are going to pop out and swing around. So we've got uh, probably just two attacks coming in at that one. At that same guy? At that okay, same cool. guy, uh, both at advantage. The so first attack is a 17 to hit. 17 to hit. For eight damage. Okay. And then the his uh, his buddy following through is going to swing low as his friend swung high. And that's going to be a 19 to hit for another eight All damage. All right, nice. Two falchions swing around the wall as this guy presses up against it. One of them cutting into his arm, and the other right into his throat, slashing Ooh. his throat as he drops to the ground. Shasta. Dead. Nice. Nice oh, hit. Nice. Ah, you as well. Shut up. Did you have uh, your... Yeah. Uh, you know, I, I was thinking he would, but uh, I'm actually going to not do the thing he was going to okay. do. So he's just going to cast Produce Flame. Yeah. And just move over a little bit. Somebody. I don't think he can reach anybody with it. Yeah, because thirty is a bird. Or um, no, I think he just wants to hold it for now. Okay, because cool. it stays until he uses it, right? Right. Yeah, it's nice. Why not? Right. Sure. Uh, is this you round two? That one's yours. Yeah. Is this round two? Um, yes. Oh, it's I'm right here. Yeah. Yeah. Call my cat. <laughs> <tag. laughs> no, Fire. she didn't oh, take her right. right. I see. Right. What you're saying. Yeah. yeah, you didn't. No. Go ahead. Hey, get him in here. Do some damage. I'm gonna hit this guy. All right. So yeah. So. By time you join the fight. Eighteen. Eighteen will hit. Or let's just go with eight. Eight damage? Yeah. Okay. So does UI get a turn? UI does. And uh, <sighs> well, it's actually about to be your turn again, so we'll just have UI go twice since we missed one. Okay. Nice. So, UI. Awesome. Uh, I'm going to stand over here. All right. I'm going to shoot those guys. They're dead. They're, they're dead. dead. They're dead? They're dead? If they're laying down, they're dead. <laughs> You, well, you, you could shoot probably that guy. see him or over this. Yeah, because you're 30 he feet would, up. He would, he would, yeah, you are 30 feet up, so you've got him. You've got him. He might oh. have half cover, though, because okay. uh, he is pretty well protected there. Well, then I'll take my first Shoot Shooter! Um, 12 Good. plus 7. So you got it. You got it. 19. Um, so oh, 19? He actually, because Whoa. of his cover, is just barely going to get out. The other one's an 18 plus 7. So okay, that one's a 20. Nice. Pretty good. He's Your first dressed. arrow comes flying down, and he presses tight against the wall as the arrow thunks into the wood. He peeks out to take a look <laughs> to see if you're still there, and <laughs> okay. surely she doesn't have right two arrows. right in the arrows. face and takes ten damage. All right, Ow. an arrow pierces straight through one of his ears. Ow. Cool, and then 18 will hit. Left to right. Uh, and how much was damage? <laughs> ten. Okay, and 18 will not hit. Awesome. And so then he presses back up against the wall once more. And I'm going to go. All right. Mm. It's going to put us at the orcs. I lay down on the ground. All right. This guy moves around to here to form ranks with his buddy. Uh-oh. I don't like that word. What? But they're not phalanx -ers. Not so, no, but they've probably got like turbo advantage. These two over here, uh, against the both are attacking that front guy. Sure. Oh, no crit against a guy with a face. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, how did you know? I, uh, oh notes. yeah, they're both gonna hit him. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, they have 15 AC. So. All right. So the first plunges a javelin into that guy's side okay. uh, for three damage, and the second follows him up through the leg for six damage. Okay. How's that guy He's looking? Dead. He's fine. Yeah, they've got a good amount of health. He's good. I'm gonna get him up. All right, that puts us at uh, the oh, ones nice. that are over here. They're both gonna attack uh, the, the guy with the hammers there. Oh, man. Both on one. Mm -hmm. Punk. Oh, yeah, they're working together. Up. And they got a 10 and a 17. 17 hits. All right. And that guy's going to take damage. two piercing damage <laughs> oh, boy. as uh, a javelin clatters against his sword, sending a shock up his arm. <laughs> and that's going to put us at the one up yeah, that, here. That guy. Come on, that guy. Let's see what you got. All right, stepping at the nearest yard here, he got a 14 to hit, so he's going to miss. Not today. Take that, punk. Nerd. I'm scared. All right. The, uh... All right. The two uh, battle criers now start moving into the battlefield. One. They're going to go one, two, three, four, five, six. It's going to be sad. He put himself out in the open for UI's arrows. 
and he's gonna get to there. Empty. And uh, as they do so, you hear the two of them barking orders in Orcish as they start striding forward calmly. Still and not close enough to make out what they're saying. Not not quite. It's steam. Because none of you, these guys speak Orcish. Mm. Does he get any kind of extended range him. for... Yes. Gotcha. Um... Sorry, what, what, I don't know what you're asking. <laughs> for being up high? <laughs> for being up high. He doesn't yeah. get an extended range, but what he does get is he gets a line of sight over a lot of walls and stuff. Sight line is better. Um, is he within is he at range for you? Uh, oh, yeah, no, no, for sure within range cool. for me. I could I could do some stuff to him. <laughs> um, I could, so, you man. So, uh, he'll have a rough time. <laughs> I, I think I, I rightly will uh, do some stuff to him. Okay. Um, I'm just going to... Uh, Blast a, a, a magic missile from the uh, wand there. Okay. Oh, okay. boy. For, uh, yeah, what's uh, 12 minus 2, right? Uh, so this is 10 plus 3, so 13 on 13 the magic missile. Okay. And then the enduring missiles will go at him for a 14. All right. Wow. Putting your hand forward, missiles fly <laughs> out of each fingertip as that you've just caught them and tossed them back. <laughs> then your wand blasts forward, forward uh, three more missiles, and six missiles impact him, tearing through him. And he drops to the ground dead. Oh, no, he is it's, killed. It's a magical guy. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Your Yarbeer? My Yarbeer uh, sees another one of his targets has just fallen and is a little frustrated. <laughs> um, <laughs> so uh, I think he's going to... Uh, Can mine? he climb up that battlement right there? Yeah, it'll take him basically uh, his movement. Yeah, he doesn't there. need to go anywhere else. Oh, cool. Um... Let's see here. One, two, My dudes three, are four, five. Use Darn it. Yeah, not quite. Yeah, you But he can now see dudes. over these walls. Where oh, yeah. Them. I mean, there wasn't a wall here in the first place. That's, that's true, a, yeah. Because we got a ditch there, but he doesn't have so much... Uh, well, here's what I can do for you. Well, uh, he is going to cast Entangle, after all. Uh, <laughs> and he's going to cast it on this area here. Oh, nice. Okay. Uh, the Come Druid on. Spell Templates are in the bag over there. Oh, sick. Can pull it. Yeah. I can just pull that and look at that. Yes. All right, cool. Well, you do that. Yes, I will do that. Uh, what are you here doing? Uh, well, they need to make a couple strength saving throws. Okay. Or get a tangled. Or get tangled. A 19 a and a 2. Okay, well, a 2 fails. Uh, uh, was it going to hit the, the, the main, main the man big, as well? Yeah, the oh, big the battle cryer? little guy. All right, so the battle crier got a... 18. Darn. Great. <sighs> but that one is going to be that's sad. Because he's all restrained. It's, it's, like green. it's the same, right? The one that's in there, it's like a green one. Um, right I rolled a 20 and a 23 to hit. Ooh, all right. Um, they're going to do the same tactic. They're going to aim both at this all right. at one. So they do 16 damage total to that guy. All right. But they do the whole door thing from The Hobbit where like they toss each other their weapon and like duck and all right. stuff like that. <laughs> Nice, and pretty soon that bright that guy is brought low. They now flanking the other guy have a large advantage against him. All right, uh, Yarby. Um, I think that you know they can't they can't see those other guys, but you know taking taking a bit of a uh, a nod from them, they're going to do the same thing. All right. Um, the first guy is going to. Swing in his falchion with a 17 to hit. No hit. All right, he's going to deal 8 damage. All right, at uh, which guy? Uh, this guy that they had hit before. Okay, cool. Is he still up? He should... Uh, they hit him once before, but... I have, for some reason, both of those guys marked as dead, but I think I counted the, the wrong guys. Uh, so, uh, yeah, they're going to actually kill that guy. Okay. Boom. The other guy... And that's the one that passed the save, so... Yeah. Um... Can he just like step over his body and then? Yeah, it's just a little terrain. Yeah, sure. And then he's going to. Oh, uh, he crit. All right. Oh, oh boy. He's so gonna immediately kill that guy. Sweet. Sweet. Nice. Boom. Boom. Double difficult terrain now. All right. The uh, second air beer is like, let me show you how it's done. Decapitates the guy with that falchion. All right. And, uh, yeah. You like? I might do. Dudes. Oh yeah, you're good. Yeah, uh, my my this guy is gonna leap up onto the corpse of that guy and go guy of the way you dead twit and then just swing down <laughs> with both hands uh, towards his uh, enemy there. Wow, sixteens. Uh, one one. So that's a good. So that's eight damage to him. Okay, nice. Uh, and then his buddy uh, is gonna show off and is just gonna slice uh, just straight forward. Uh, whoa, good thing advantage uh, for a, a hit. So eight. All right, damage. nice. And that'll bring that guy down. Cool. And then my dude 
Can he stand on his body? His scouts are chumps. Yeah, I don't think he can. That far. <laughs> it's thirty to get to here. I'm just waiting. For oh well, the, uh, it's uh, difficult the terrain waters. onto that so body. He can almost so get there. The ice trolls. Then you know what? He's gonna. Well, he has a buddy next to him. You could throw something at him, right? No, I don't have anything. To throw. throw a rock. Just throw your weapon. <laughs> mm, don't do that. <laughs> Thaddeus learned that last time. He sure. tried that last time. Your primary. Go Not a good here, idea. And if someone comes this way, I'm going to smack him. Okay. I've been in my primary twice um, last session. I think you got that guy. So uh, UI is just going to... If you haven't gotten your spare knife. It's just going to stay here. You might be able to see that, dude. No, the, this wall. Yeah, but you, you're 30 feet up, and it's only 10 feet. We definitely would have done can I see that dude if I'm 30 feet up There's from the wall? Where's that? Yes. This guy? Yes. Yes, but he would have disadvantage because you're firing through smoke. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Might as well shoot him anyway. Or try to. Oh, wow. With disadvantage, I got a 24. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Chloe's digging through the massive darkness boxes. Uh, so I time. shot that guy in the back of the head. Okay. For 10 damage. All right, and he drops. Uh -huh. Beautiful. And then... And then <laughs> Then I lay down on the ground again. Nice shooting! Did you have an extra shot? You have another one. You could probably hit him. You could hit him. He's entangled. Oh, no, he's not. He's not. But, but, he's, but he's, he's got no cover from you. Yeah, less than... Well, the, she no, has I didn't, the, the, I didn't the have power enough. between them. Oh, I I oh well, know. scoot a little bit that way. She can see over all the walls. Yeah. So, yeah, just like that, now that the tower's not in the way. That's 11, so no. All right. An arrow whistles across the battlefield, erupting from the smoke as these Yarbeers see it come out overhead. Uh, and that Whoa. guy, seeing it coming, oh, ducks down and raises a shield to catch the arrow, and then turns back towards his target. At that point, I lay down. he's going to hop over. It's difficult terrain, right? That it is. And he's going to just step to there. And as he steps in towards his first guy, he comes walking forward, a broadsword in one hand, a shield in the other, and raises his broadsword, clashing against the Falchion uh, for a 13 and an 18. The 18 hits. All right, doing 12 slashing Whoa. damage. Oh. That's a lot. All right, I'm real glad you brought the other one of those down before it's he had Steve. a chance to kill all our guys. Okay. Hey, do well, that again. That was Max. I'm going to do that oh. again. <laughs> So uh, I'm just going to chill touch on that dude. All right. For, uh, nice, I think, a, a, yeah, what's that, a 23 to hit? 23 to hit. And that'll be for 7 necrotic damage. All right. And then the bonus action enduring missiles are going to rail at him again as well. Wow. For uh, <laughs> 8 force okay. damage. All right. Several missiles fly forwards as one of your crawling claws goes skittering across the battlefield and up under his <laughs> tunic and starts, like, clawing at his legs. Uh, that's gonna put us at your yard. Yeah, I like that you My got just like twenty Good. of those things running around. They, yeah, they're all over the place. Who knows? <laughs> Who can keep track? He's a handy fellow. Um, the yardbeer can't get him <laughs> with anything, unfortunately. All right. Um, so I think he is just going to hang out for this turn. All right. Yep. That's all he can do. Um, your yard jokes were some of the worst. They stand ready for any other foe that are coming. All right. Cool. Your yardbeer. Grant? Grant. Um, Sorry, he's just being horrible. bombarded by Gregory. Well, then they're both bombarded. just going to attack that guy. All right. Uh, the first one has a 20 to hit. Yeah. hit so, 8 damage. Okay. The second has a 21 to hit. That'll hit. So, 8 more damage. All right. All right. Uh, that's going to put us at your yard here. Um, let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Six, eight, bummer. Uh, so no, can't really get into range. Uh, and yeah, I, I think we heard about the the book of black magic yeah. that these orcs have. Okay, I think my guys are gonna spend their actions chopping the heads off of these. Uh, okay, these he head and weapon arm. Okay, fair enough. So, fair enough. So we'll just have two he head and weapon armless orcs there. I look over at the other two and go, "You have got this. You missed one there. I did not. You I." Hi. Um, can I? By the way, you can see now on the other side of the field, um, Gork is shouting way. something, and underneath the red flag, you can see another flag rising as the red flag lowers. You can see an orange flag rising. They're gonna go through the whole rainbow on us. What is that? Roy mean? G. Bib. We don't know yet. Danger level has. Agree. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Danger, real right. Robinson. We won. They're, they're giving up. Uh, can I ready uh, an arrow well, for as soon as I well, see them like get close? I can sure. Shoot. Yeah. Absolutely. That's my action. All right. Then that puts us at this guy. 
over here, and uh, having having slashed into that guy, he's now going to change targets and try to hit the other guy that's over there, okay. uh, swinging his broadsword for an 18 and a 16. Mm. Uh, both hit. Slashing twice into that guy for 10 damage and then 11, Whoa. bringing oh, his broadsword in a deft X. Oh, right. That no. brings that guy down. All oh, right. No. And as that guy falls, you can see him turn and roar at the other one, just a guttural... Roar! Yeah. Um, and his his broadsword's now dripping with Yarbeer blood. The first Yarbeer blood spilled in the battle. That was, of that course, was that enough to yeah. kill him. Yeah. 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 Well, that sounded what? bad. I had to... Look at all the people Ooh. that my two well, guys have been fighting. You've done well. Like, hey, my guys threw rocks. That wolf. You, so we, you did one damage to that wolf. Two you damage. sure did. Sir, two damage. You yeah. missed with one rock. Yeah, but, the yeah, but he did two damage because he did one damage plus the one from his strength. Well, the chill touch is not enough to get past his armor. All right. Uh, however, the however. The, uh, the enduring missiles will strike for ten force damage. All right. And your Uh is once again without a paddle. Uh, so he hurls a produced flame in that direction. Okay. <laughs> it, does, it goes nowhere. It misses because it's <laughs> outraged. <laughs> Grant? Mine are going to ready in action uh, if seeing their brothers behind them, actually. Okay. They're going to wonder why they decapitated. Okay. So one of them is going to walk over and go, what? Okay. Take his axe and just cleave it down uh, the center of one of the heads. Okay. And then the other one's gonna just splitting it down the center. The other one's gonna take both of his hammers and just smash the head together. Just okay. slat. All right. Hold on, Tommen, we're coming. Your yarbeer. My yarbeer is going to see that his when his comrade has fallen, he's going to turn um, his back quickly and shout to his friends behind him, uh, requesting for their aid quickly. And then All he's right. gonna hold his action to attack this guy oh, when whenever one is closer. Whenever one Smart. gets closer. And, uh, and his friends are coming, so this one's just I've got it! And he dashes in to stand sort of, you know, on the uh, over his fallen friend right. and gets into range. He can't do anything else, but his buddy's gonna run up and throw a rock. Alright. And th- go on How does throw. 14 treat you? That'll hit? Oh, no, that will not hit. Yeah. Uh, Even with advantage? Even with advantage. Oh, man, I'm throwing my rock with advantage. Yeah, 14, so no. Yikes. This dude is impervious right. to rocks and falchions. I don't like it. At this point... Uh, My guy's standing. Oh. All right. Where should I go? What do you You think? should shoot that guy. I, it's not her turn. I'm oh. Not going. oh, I thought it was her turn. Oh, excuse guy. me. Oh, yeah, your guy should stay. Oh, yeah, yeah he's, he's too All right. right. Well, at this point, the battle oh, boy. shifts. Oh, boy. To Orange you see... Something right level on large base. That guy died. His feet fell off. His guy, guy falls. Oh he dies. Two orc longbowmen oh mounted on no. auroks. I see one. What's an auroch again? Uh, it's like a huge, like woolly cow type thing. Hmm. Um, but they're they're built for battle. They're the They've got the speed of a horse, yeah. um, and the, they're of built, course they're yeah. they're armored too. And you can see <laughs> three <laughs> ogre spearmen <laughs> coming in. Okay. Alright, which one do you want to shoot? Uh, I want to shoot an archer. Okay. Um, got a 23. 23. But only did 6 damage. 6 damage? Okay, cool. An arrow whistles oh. forward, slamming into an archer as the battle shifts. Reroll for initiative. Ooh, cool. Nick, you uh, better roll good. Ha. This is 120 feet away. <laughs> You get like a five. Uh, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Not bad. Oh, see, better than five. It's Thirteen. Thirteen. Uh-huh. So after I did that, I was just gonna go la 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 la. <laughs> Back to the ground. La, 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 la. Back to reality. Are you actually falling down, or are you just taking a knee? Behind the wall. I mean, I'm probably just ducking behind it. I'm not laying on my back on the ground just, like it's not my turn. Uh, it's not my turn. It's my turn. turn. Lay down for you know four seconds. Pop back up. And well, then... it's covering after suppressive fire, so like I guarantee that these orcs have launched a few All right. arrows into her. This orc riding forward draws back his longbow, having knocked an arrow, and he's aiming up at the hill where you eye is. Okay. Yeah. Uh, well, jokes on this him. one over here. Shooting arrows at a just, monk. Just crawl over here. <laughs> <laughs> this is true. That's fair. <laughs> no, this one over here, 
uh, looses an arrow as he rides forward at this Yarbeer here. Uh oh. Okay. Um, and as he does so. Was that your Yarbeer? That's there? mine. Yeah. Bummer. 23 to hit. It's, wow! That's got him. Dealing 11 mm -hmm. piercing damage. Straight oh, no. between the eyes. No! No! All right. Oh. And you can see that these bows, uh, it seems that the orcs are very skilled with this bow, yep. and they have a very long, heavy draw uh, because of the massive muscles of an orc, yep. and they seem to be much stronger than a bow that would be fired by a human. Yeah, it's Actually. time to cover and wait for them to come to us. <laughs> All right. Uh, that puts us at esteem. Okay, well, I'm going to see that dude's causing some problems. He is within range of my magic missiles, so I'm going to toss one of those at him. At the archer over there? Yep. Ooh, uh, oh, yes. That'll be for uh, 13 force damage on the magic missiles. All right, nice. And then, be hitting... and then I'll follow up with the enduring missiles for right. another 14. Wow. All force right. Damage. A barrage of missiles <clears throat> slams into that guy, and you can see him like slump back in the saddle as the creature keeps barreling forward. You can Ooh, lay him down nice. on top of the arm. That's good. That's not great. Oh, uh, it's fine. All right, and then I'm gonna uh, crouch down behind the. Uh -huh. uh -huh. That was intentional. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> it was for intimidation. The Auroch comes it's running forward, forward <laughs> slamming into this barricade and breaking oh. it down. It's now just difficult terrain instead of costing yeah. half movement yeah. to reach so over. It's double difficult terrain. <laughs> All right. Don't eat any of this. Are the, okay, oh, and then uh, the Yarbier, I'm sorry. Ogre okay. Smith? You're, no, not yet. Not okay. your beer. Um, well, my Yarbier. Yeah, he's, he, he's fine with what's going on right now. <laughs> he, he's he's, he's feel, feeling pretty comfortable. Um, call light yeah, he, he's gonna, <laughs> no, he did not. Not a fourth level spellcaster. <laughs> so he's going to hang out. All right. Once again. Uh, Sam, you're your beer. They're going to cut. No, that's fine. One of the uh, they're gonna peek their head out to see what that noise was. They now see a couple ogres and uh, a pig, and um, they're going to start hacking the log at the end of this wall. Okay. So the log will fall and create a barrier in which something okay. above it average. Okay. It, it won't create a full barrier, but what it will do is sort of fall in an angle. angle so like wall, so an ogre would have a really difficult time sure, to get yeah. through it. Well, he just. Push it. Shut <laughs> up, Nick. All right, I'm just tied up with this t-shirt. So, uh, they do so. God. Nope, they'll do it. It's fine. <laughs> he'll just Are slice that up with the very tip of huh? his uh, all right? foil. Yeah. <laughs> None of the worst. <laughs> all right. I'm being made fun we're, of. We're fucking you Sam a little bit. Oh, wait, I'm uh, sorry. More, more uh, your, uh, your, uh, your, his or D? Uh, mine or D? Why, why don't you give him one of yours? I know, that's oh, what I said. Sure. So uh, have yeah. that guy. He's, <laughs> he's all guy. mad. His friend's dead. I'm we're running gonna try in. try to split the RB up as much as possible. Okay. Uh, you can go at the same time. That'll yeah. work. We're we're running in. Let's go. I'm taking a swing. You take a swing. Oh, yeah? hoo Vengeance! Oh, yeah. That's a good advantage. All right. Uh, 16. Uh, both will hit. Nice. Oh, well, on that guy. On that guy. Uh, what was the nat 17? Uh, the nat 17 to 22. That'll hit. The other one will not. Six so, will not hit. eight damage coming in. Okay. And uh, as moving forward, as uh, your yard here swings his falchion and holding the broadsword, he turns to his buddy and says, Strike now! And the other guy takes the legs out <laughs> from under the orc and kicks him over, slashing across his chest while he's on the ground. I knew to strike now. It's not my first scrap. <laughs> All right. Uh, now it's your. I... This is a this mine, is a mine blood turned battle. around and seeing that that guy well seeing that that guy was an archer, I'm not gonna stand up in the same spot. I'm gonna like crawl over here. Okay. And then I'm gonna stand up over here. Alright, he's still gonna fire at you, but at disadvantage since you moved. Yeah. Uh so let's see what happened. Look at this bloodbath right here. It's a mess. That's pretty good. Alright, so he only got a thirteen. Uh, that does not hit. All right, an arrow slams into your cover. Remember, you have plus two to your AC because you're behind half cover. Yeah. Oh, okay. I will not remember I'll, that. I'll save uh, you our monk. <laughs> uh, so grab it and throw it back. My lowest yeah. is a 17 yeah. to hit right him. 17 will hit. 27 will hit. He missed. He went wide. Right over. Um, Lord, so it does <laughs> eight, nine, uh, wait, oh gosh, 17 
damage. <laughs> Alright. Okay. Eight, nine, Your seven, arrow goes eight. flying straight towards him as his arrow slams just into chest height, right right in front of you on your on the wooden Ding. barricade, or stone barricade that's there. And uh, your arrow pierces right through his throat, and he hangs down, being dragged across the ground by the saddle um, as that Arok continues forward. That's concerning. How, how much forward? What are they going to do? Oh, okay. All right. About the cows? No, what are the cows going to do? Graze. They're not grazing right now. <laughs> uh, yeah, they're more like uh, they're like big, angry line. bulls than anything else. They'll aggressively graze. Look here, graze chill out, there. Ferdinand. I'm going to eat all your grass. <laughs> you better watch out. Was there speed? Out <laughs> no. That whole bale of hay. That's not, that's not pretty slow. Whoa. Stop that. <laughs> that's, stop. Don't, don't do it. Oh, jeez. Oh, my. Our Lord, that hurry. Mm. And what are those? Those are ogres? These are ogre spearmen. <laughs> with their with their tiny, tiny heads. <laughs> I love it. All right, and I'm going to say that this one's going to dash. To imagine that there's one. Wow. Oh, oh. As he gets to here, he takes a spear, and he just plunges it into that stick. And, uh, and so it's, he's got the stick now at the end of his spear, what and he heck? tears it off, oh. and he's holding it in his other hand. <laughs> I hate you, Nick. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't do the thing as I would. <laughs> All right. Uh, the one in the center there hefts up uh, one of the uh, spikes that's that's part of that palisade there, that oh, wall. Boy. And as he tears it off of the wall, he's going to chunk it forward, not really at anything in particular. He just he can't really see, but he can hear that there's guys back there. And these guys back there hear a... Doof! Oh, boy. As a big wooden spike slams into the wall, and they can see it protruding from the wall now. <laughs> Yikes. Cool. All right, that puts us at. Oh, that's not good. Okay, uh, well, no, I'm gonna uh, go uh, ahead and cast a spell. Okay. Uh, that's that a. Time. Uh, I'm gonna okay. cast a spell. Yeah, it's a, okay. So that's. Mm, Actually, it's not as not as not so great because if he. I'll just make him fail. So uh, I'm casting, <laughs> I'm casting Binding Chains. Okay. This is a uh, third level spell, uh, 120 feet range. Uh, so four chains burst from the ground and attack one creature within 10 feet. Uh, so I'm just going to attack this dude. Okay. So he needs to make a deck save or he's restrained. He rolls a three. Okay. Uh, or a five, excuse me. Uh, so Take he, he takes 1d6 piercing per chain at the start of each of his turns. Which oh, is okay. four of them. Uh, so 4d6 <laughs> at the start of each of his turns. Uh, and when it happens, I'd imagine, as well. Does it only say at the start of each of his turns? That's what I wrote down. So that's what I guess. All right, I'll go so with we'll that. just go with that. Um, the rest of it only applies if he Seems succeeds like that. So the escape DC is the spell save plus the number of chains. So oh, right now it is DC 19. Okay, and he's restrained, right? Yeah. Okay, cool. And what save is it? Uh, it is a dex save. He can't make those while he's restrained. It's probably a strength check to escape from. Okay. Probably. Yeah. Yes. Escape DC is always yeah. either uh, strength yeah. or uh, acrobatics. I think. Yeah. 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 All right. Cool. Sense. But still, that makes the DC. Uh, like and then as a bonus action, action, I'll wail on him with my with my forces. All right. On with that one. Yep. Yes. On that restrained dude. Right. So that's going to be fifth. Seventeen plus, plus, plus damage. Plus. Which All one's right. restrained? Nice, this dude. Uh, so your blast of missiles start tearing into him as these chains grab at him with with hooks at the end, hooking oh. into each of his legs and pulling him down. <laughs> and he starts grabbing and tearing at these chains that are hooked now into his flesh. He can also choose to attack them. They're oh. like a DC. I actually didn't write it down. But they have like an AC. Go ahead and look they, that they up. They have an AC. Yeah. Probably some, do that. That's most likely. Uh, maybe we'll see. Uh, all right, and you're Yarbier. My Yarbeer uh, is going to see this dude showing up. All right. He's going to try a similar thing. He's going to recast his... Um, Entangle. Entangle. Makes sense. All right. Guys, yeah, so he needs to make a strength saving through. Put, put these guys back on the, the pile of death. Uh, 17. Okay, so he's fine. But All he's right. restrained. Or he's not restrained. No, he's just, but he's in difficult terrain. Yes. All right. It'll momentarily... Uh, your Yarbeer, Sam. A little annoying. My Yarbeer going to notice that that... Plan did not work again accordingly. Um, they're gonna turn around and with the wild muster of the Yarbeer, they're gonna go and All right. try to go after Let's this go ogre. Boys. Um, 
Both okay. of them are gonna just run up to it, sure. dodge one of the spears that's coming at them, yeah. and then yeah. try to yeah. both yeah. put yeah. their axes into its leg. Alright. Um, 8 plus 5. 8 plus 5. Alright, so two 13s. Yep. Alright, both of them come running forward and thrust their spears, f- or their, their falchions forward with, with slashing uh, swings. However, <sighs> they just slash straight against <sighs> the hide that he's got on his <clears throat> legs. God, they have terrible aim. All right. Okay. Yeah, he's got. It looks like these guys have some thick hide armor here. Uh, that puts us then at your yard. Yeah, Which one are you thinking? Uh, when I'm kill the cow. I don't know if we want to kill the cow or if we want to go and fight the. Does, does the cow look real mad at us still? It just looks like it's charging straight forward. Oh yeah, we should just get out the way. We should just get out of the way and go fight this guy yeah, who's entangled. So he is not actually, but you would know about. Aurochs, they're native to this area, and the Yarbir would know that an Aurok in a dangerous situation fights like just a mad, hungry dog against everything near it. Uh, so get out of the way, and okay. it'll just it'll just go. Maybe. Presumably. S- maybe. So get on the other side of the big fella. It's so one, two, three, four, five. Mm. You sure? I want to get right uh-huh. up in there with the... That's better. All right. Yeah, I'll just move there, and... Uh, I'm not really doing anything else, I think. All right. All right. You're your I'm going to do a similar thing. One, two, three, four, five, six. And I'm kind of wondering if we dash up there. Yeah. Uh, could dash. Or both throw a rock. <laughs> <laughs> David and Goliath is crap. <laughs> uh, I say we probably both dash. I have to just get up in its face and out of the way of this thing. Yeah, yeah. yeah but you're going to... Yeah, I think we're probably going to end up being over here. Because uh, we you don't have to... this one is a train. Oh, you are very correct. Let's go that way. All right. The Yarbeer breaking from their stronger foe start heading towards the one in chains. Haley, you're Yarbeer. We should have got a wizard sooner. <laughs> I say, just making the assumption it was probably the creepy dark elf. Well, we're spending, yeah. a, we're spending a lot of people on one ogre. I, yeah. It's an, it's an ogre. It's an ogre. And we might be able to just kill it and then it. go gang up on that dude. The two casters can get on that dude when he has when he's in range of mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. We'll try to survive yeah, this just, one You can ogre. just pew pew at him. What are you doing? I'm dashing this way so that I don't get hurt. And it takes half your movement to leap over one of those Why not just run up straight to him? Because I don't want him to punch me in the face when I get up there. He's in chains. He has a hard time punching you. He has to hit the chain. He doesn't have to. to. But he'll be at disadvantage unless he's attacking a chain. No, even then. Oh, that's right. I'm supposed to look up the HP. Nick! Oops. It's okay. It's at the beginning. You silly Billy. All right. I couldn't hit him anyway. He's too far away. Each of the Aurochs barrels forward now dashing. So dashing. (laughs) <laughs> oh, that ogre's between us and it. And as this one runs, it comes right up to the pit, and it's going to go tumbling oh. into the pit, impaling itself on the spikes. You can hear its uh, death cries as it's wounded and bleeding out, but not instantly it's, it's killed. A cow, it's a cow, it's a cow, not a pig. Not a pig. <laughs> and you can see this poor creature uh, no. impaled upon the spikes, unable to get out, struggling as it's bleeding to death. It'll be a long, slow death. I like how you just stare directly at her. It's gonna die! <laughs> a painful death. Well, she's right and it's all your fault. Uh, this one... Let it die. Yeah, ...comes yeah, barreling yeah. forward. I'm, ju- I'm just telling you, that's what you see. This one comes barreling forward straight towards uh, that wall. And as it heads this direction, it starts to veer away from the fiery wall. And that puts us at... You are. Yay! So I crit. I told Nick about it, so he right. back me up. Uh, I'm hitting this guy. All right. <laughs> um, six. So it does ten damage. That All right. The face. Oh. Loose from and your bow, an arrow heads straight towards that uh, spearman slamming into his shoulder. And then the other one does ten damage, too. All right. Uh-huh. So twenty damage. All right. Nice. Nice. Cool. nice. The crit was ten damage? Yeah, I rolled two threes. Yeah, bummer. All right. That puts us at the ogres. So, we'll start over here. This one, having seen its prey turn, is going to go... Uh, is it like that? Yeah, yes. it is. Yep. Okay, cool. Then he's going to go one, two, three, four, uh, five, six, seven, eight. 
and then he's going to dash to put himself here. Uh-oh. All right. Uh, Uh-oh, my God. That one there in the center that's uh, restrained, it's going to start te- oh. tearing at its chains. The chains are AC 18 okay. with 10 hit points and resistance yeah. to damage. Then it's just going to try to keep running and pull the chains out of the ground with it. The DC is what again? 19 to break 19. Through. All right. He, he just rips one leg upwards, and it tears down through his leg. Oh, right. Ow. A deep gouge. Oh, right, oh, take the damage at the beginning of his turn. Yep. Yep. Oh. Whoa. 16. Ah, 21. Oh, oh man. Yeah, 21 All slashing right. damage. He roars in pain, still held in place <clears throat> by those chains. That's rough. The <gasps> third ogre over here fighting against Sam's Yarbeer. Bring it up. Uh, he hefts his uh, his spear in one hand and he plunges it forward into the Yarbeer on my right. Uh, and that's going to be a 15 to hit. Right on the money. All right, and that's going to deal 16 pieces <laughs> <laughs> and he needs to make a strength save. <laughs> I don't like that at all. Make that oh, strength save with guy? your plus one. 19. Oh, 19. Nice. All right, nice. at the last moment as the spear plunges forward, it gouges into his side, but he manages to hold his ground. He then takes the, the big pike that, or mm-hmm. spike that he's oh, holding on the other hand, and he plunges it into the other guy. You can try. 16 to hit? Crap. Did it. All right. All right. You can try. And that's going to be 16 piercing damage, uh, and that guy needs to make a strength save. Jeez. Yeah, I don't, I don't much like these fellers. That's pretty bad. Oh, nice seven. Bad. All right. That guy goes flying back 10 feet. Which guy? Oh, the one on the left. That one right there. Yeah. It's okay. Get back in there, champ. And he is flying back 10 feet as he's slammed into by this spike. Um... I like that. That's just, they do massive damage. Also, you go back a bit because they hit you real hard. It'd be bad if you were on a cliff or something. Uh-huh. Yeah. All right. Steam. Hey, <laughs> well, uh, for the well, record, when have we I, ever fought in I realized terrain? that uh, the binding chains are concentration, so I lost the. Oh, gotcha. Yep. Oh, so wow. that's that is a bummer because it was for a spell. But that's uh, that is what it is. That's I okay. Am going what you're to, doing uh, right now is pretty good. It's fine. I'm gonna uh, chill touch that dude. All right. From where I'm at, it's a crit. Oh, nice. Oh, oh, yeah. 48. That's a crit. So that's going to be a nice 9, 12, 13. On damage. that same middle guy? On that middle guy. All right, nice. All right. So he's so still up. Claws start swarming him, tearing so themselves here. out of the ground, and start climbing up his legs. He's still standing. He's batting at claws on his sides and pulling his legs, trying to get free of these chains. Your Yarbeer. Ah, uh, my Yarbeer has nothing to do. All right. So he is going to uh, hang out. All right. Your yard here. Um, uh, this one just got slammed onto his back. He's going to get up. And while the one on the right is struggling with a spear in his side, he's going to hold on to it uh, with uh, his hammers while that one is going to try to bring down an axe and cleave the guy's hand off. All right. Mm. That sucks. Ooh. That will be the hammer guy's hand. <laughs> All right. Here goes. Yeah, the, as he grabs on, he swings a hammer into the guy's leg, and it just bounces yeah, off. Uh, here goes the axe nine, hit. Uh, what you got? Thirteen. Thirteen. Is that cocked or not? It's up to y'all. Uh, I, it's I, a little bit cocked. It's, I'll, I'll it's a little bit cocked. That's better. That's Twenty better. to hit. Twenty will hit. Yeah, he takes Yay. eight damage to the wrist. Take that. All right, nice. Take the and He cuts Wait, deep into the guy's wrist. Is and he humanoid? yeah, uh, I don't think so. What? Are they humanoid? They're no, ogres. They're giants. giants. Ah. Yeah. yeah, what you got? Oh, that was you. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so moving in. I'm moving in, <laughs> and we are going to. Uh, yeah, I, I'm, I'm moving in. I'm going to take the up attack, I guess. Oh, well, what's their reach? I also just their reach. Mm-hmm. Uh, their reach is ten feet. I will not even take an opportunity attack. Neato. All right. So we're yeah we're moving in to just hit this dude that's restrained because the heck with that guy. Uh, I've got a. Sp- 14 to hit? That will not yeah, quite do it. I've got him, though. I've got a 23 to hit. 23 will hit? Yeah, so, 8 damage. You did roll an advantage, right? Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah, taking a spear, you plunge your spear straight through the hide armor that he's wearing as he's restrained by the chains. That puts us at... My, your my, yeah, he's going to run in. He's going to do 18 to hit. That'll hit. And he will do 8 damage as he right, smacks nice. that guy right in the face. The Aurochs now, uh, or that Auroch is, is still, this one's now wheeling around. 
Oh no! Not you no one. And that puts us at UI. I'm gonna stand up. I'm gonna shoot <laughs> this guy. Uh, oh, you don't want to run in and axe him? Shoot the no, shoot the, <laughs> the cow. This guy's dying. He's he's in a other cow. Uh, mm. He's taking no damage. You can hit that. It doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Uh, for fifteen damage total. Fifteen will do it. And the reason I asked if it was humanoid is because I, I, I crit it's on him. You oh, crit? you crit on him? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Again? Doing that. No, no. Would it, would it have done oh. anything? Oh, uh, he is a humanoid in the technical sense, just not in the mechanical sense. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah okay. you can crit him. So that was on your last turn. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I didn't crit again. That was yeah. a lot of But it did happen. So let's, yeah, let's so see. the Restrained we, Brother we is going to have a camp totally to do that last turn. What did I D100. roll? D100. D100. No, we didn't. We used that several times. Yeah, we used oh, it several times. I mean, during the fight with the... With the guy? We they never, the dream? he never crit us. 77. Mm-hmm. 77. 77. Oh boy, that's not going to be not awesome. great. Uh, 70 section, 7, uh, he it's suffers an internal seven. injury. Okay. Oh, that's fine. So whenever he attempts an action in combat, he must make a DC 15 con save. Okay. On a failed save, he loses his action and can't take reactions until the start of his turn. All right. Yeah, so your arrow wow, dug pretty good. deep into his ribs, and it looks like there's just, just the blood feathers are coming out. Yeah. All right. No, he... We did use that during your fight with Mint? that guy. We did. Yeah. yeah, I just meant during our fight with the Dreamer. I don't know if oh. we used it. Because I'm pretty sure I got crit. Uh, you got cr- a crit against him? Yeah. Yeah, that was intentional that we oh, used okay. it then. Because it was just an illusion. Wow. Uh, bloody wrong, crowned wrong. eye. Remember you can roll before it's your turn. Jerks. <laughs> oh, I already did. Took you a bit. Okay. It's not my turn anymore. My turn's over. Oh, I thought you were adding up. <laughs> okay. I thought you were doing something else. I'm doing my next turn. Oh, all right, I'm sorry. That, uh, that puts us at yeah, the ogre. Fine. So let's start with that one that's uh, that's wounded over there. Take that damage, Nick. He got a 17 uh, on his con save. Okay, so he can uh, So even with that arrow, oh, that he bellows a guttural roar, plunges a spear into the uh, into one of the guys for a 22 to hit. Yeah, that yep. guy's probably dead. Dealing 16 damage. He, the one on the right's dead. All right, so, and then uh, dropping the spike, yeah, he grabs the spear in both hands and plunges uh, it towards the other guy, who ducks underneath oh, it, rolling on the ground a log roll straight towards the guy, landing right underneath him, the ogre looking down at him, as the ogre twists the spear in his hands and holds it, ready to impale straight downwards. He's about one to in the center there. For what it's parts. worth, the one in the center also got crit. All right. Um, so, uh, and I all rolled a 76, so okay. it's the same, same thing. thing. Cool. Yep. Um, oh, wow, that's real good yeah, for so, that guy. Yeah, so he's going to take 17 slashing damage from those right. chains, uh, and then he can choose to do what he... Or All he, right. can, he got a 26 on the con save. So he can do stuff. Okay. Uh, so, stuff. so... <laughs> that's <fun>. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> that so... Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Though the crawling claws, some of them, like, penetrated some of his wounds, and you can see them moving around oh, underneath his skin. Gnarly. He's now roaring and tearing he's at his own so flesh, evil. and he's going to use his action to try to tear free of those chains. Okay. Uh, you know what? He's not even. Uh, since he's surrounded now, he's just going to start swinging his spear about. Cool. Uh, and he has disadvantage. So the first one is a 13. Against Ooh. one of the Yarbeer, and the second's an 11. <laughs> He's wildly swinging his spear, and the Yarbeer, using his slowness and his wounded uh, his wounded skin here uh, as an advantage, they start moving around Duck. and getting out of the way. <laughs> <laughs> the last of them, now, from behind there, just plunges his spear straight into that guy's back. Me. For a uh, 15 oh. to hit. Oh, no, that's exactly that's enough. Got him. That's got him. And a, another 15. <sighs> he right. was at full health. No, All right, and that's going to be, uh, between the two, a total of 32 piercing That's damage. enough. My <laughs> All right, again. One spear after another into this guy. He lifts him up with a spear, flips him up into the oh, air, and geez. whirls it around, slamming him into the wall, pinning him to the wall with a spear. He Ugh. then reaches behind him and grabs onto one of the spikes from that wall and replaces his spear oh. with that spike. Oh, man, I wish this was bludgeoning or piercing or something. Oh, it's yeah. It's elemental. Bummer. All right, oh good. Put the set. Son of a gun. Esteem. It's not ideal. Esteem, Esteem kills uh, something. I'm gonna dude. do another, do another chill touch on that dude. That's that's hurting. That's a hey, on there guy, we go. So I think right. that'll play ball. Oh, it's oh, really cool. <laughs> so uh, that's gonna Stop be rolling those crit damage. Thirteen necrotic damage. I was deep. like, not, you can do damage. forty-eight with yep. a chill yeah, touch. Yeah, I'm just uh, you know an eighteen. Why would I ever play anything else? Then specifically esteem. And that is what I got. All right, no, and your yarbeer is not doing anything. 
Oh yeah, I forgot your beer. Um, he can't. He's so really? far away. Right. I mean, he could entangle again, but he probably won't. But that's uh, fine, and so. that Yarbeer does look to you, and he says, uh, "Our soldiers can't handle those ogres. They need to pull out if they're gonna survive." I agree. If you agree, <laughs> then give the order. Oh, oh, I, they're following you. That's what oh, Arden said. Yeah. Uh, then I'll call out, uh, "Pull back!" All right. I <laughs> disengage back. <sighs> Uh, disengage back 30 feet, six squares. All right. Not that way. Towards the entrance. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Line them up! Alright, what are you doing? It, I'm, it, dead. I'm dead. Oh, okay. oh right. Uh, that's right, I forgot that I lost my guy. My, my buddy. Uh, I'm, I'm, I, Do you want to take over just, Haley's then? I might just dash out. No, okay. So. Um, just and him. just take the opportunity attack. I want to be sure. Like, I any want to be a witness. Nah, you know what? That, that, that guy had not taken uh, any damage to that point. I'm gonna, three I'm of his guys are out My full 30 feet. Haley just straight dodging between the guys to avoid difficult terrain. Well, is he is. He's a disadvantage to attack you. Uh, yeah, I could just dash. I'm going to dash and then go way around that cowl. So, like, around that way a little bit so he can't. So, go ahead and make that opportunity to take disadvantage. Uh, the one who's restrained? Uh-huh. He's actually too busy with the chains. Oh. He's okay. going to chicken know. over with you. It's must leave. I'm gone. I'm Is leaving. this yar beer hey, berserking and just going to kill something? Oh, man. Wait, hold on. My yar beer saw his exactly friend right. fall. Yeah. He's not... Oh. He's, he's not, not backing up? He's okay. not he's going to go fight up. that right, guy that kills his buddy? Orders. Yeah, because I rolled a, a nat 12, which is a 17 to hit. All right. Here's where we find out that there are plate armor. Did you see earlier? Oh, uh, you said a couple. Okay. Which I think means one. Uh, and I believe <laughs> you said he was old and feeble and had no arms. <laughs> oh, I did say that. Yeah. Uh, they, they called him They called him Scrawny Steve, <laughs> the, the go, worst dashing. troll. <laughs> I'll say. You're going to leap over that? I All am right. going to jump over. Is that where you're going to go? Feet, yeah. he, had a, he had a... All right, well. A pet hummingbird. You can up. see now. Does 17 hit? What? Does 17 hit? On who? On that ogre. It'll hit. Okay, uh, so as he's below this ogre with the spear coming towards him, he plows his axe straight into the gut of the ogre. Ogre. Okay. <laughs> For eight damage. Eight, eight damage. All right, cool. You can see now the orcs on the hill moving aside as a yellow flag is raised. Oh, come on! The orange flag <laughs> is lowered. We've got three guys left. Danger level went down. Everyone went down. for initiative. Yay! Yay! We're back in the game. Everyone! Yay! With stuff to do. <sighs> well, I'm back to the right, Osborne. Wasted a crit. 14. Esteem. 7. UI. 24. That is. Uh, 1. One. Yeah. One, two. God, guys. <laughs> We're right. big and slow. What do you want? I'm on a ram. I got no excuses. It's real speedy. <laughs> I've walked all the way here. I, I'm I'm riding in the back of the ram and have a better initiative than you do. But you were ready to go. I was bent low over the over the reins. I'm actually. Do you have the little horse thing you use for ram over there? Like I'm actually only a one hit point off. Nice. I'm, I'm way off of Max. What? I don't see it. How yep, I just kidding. It's right here. No. Nothing. Nothing. Nope. Nothing. Uh, yeah. Yep. So. Where are we coming in from? This is what I'm You thinking. guys will be coming in. If uh, Grant will raise his dice tray. Yep. You guys will be coming in, in from the edge of the board. Uh, anywhere in those first two large trees. Grant. I'm sorry. Skinny that... thoughts, bro. Listen. <laughs> Think them all you want, but like, uh, I'm here to tell you it doesn't actually hey, make a physical Hey, I am, I am compacted over here. All right. So am I. And you can see... He's pretty compact. Greg, compact more. Excuse me. Three frost trolls. Go. Go. I thought we dodged They them. were going stride for stride with us, huh? You followed them. It seems like they came in from that angle. They might have uh, arrived just before you mm. and now have been sent into battle. Headed from that direction, you can see overhead come flying in two manticores. Or captains on manticores. I think we should ride our ram that way. Currently, they're about 100 feet up. And, and a contingent oh, a of man. pikemen now. Oh, Here we go. yeah, yo! If you've got more, uh, if you got more AOE, Nick, this would be the time. Because Nick, I have zero. Yeah, a, a lightning bolt would be would be Hashtag grand. Hashtag line them up. 
Yeah. <laughs> can do cheap. <laughs> Climb up. Right. Can do cheap. Do I. You've got the initiative. Awesome. Does she see us coming in? Colby, I have um... one question. Yeah. How long has it been since we were okay, fire. in the cave? Oh, uh, about eight or nine hours. Very fire template. Oh, you need that. Yeah. All right. Dang it. <laughs> what? Exactly eight hours? Are you sure? A little bit more. Why? Because Death oh, Lord lasts death eight hours. Oh. I cast that right before that last fight. Yeah, that. that would definitely be worn out then. Oh, by the way, Evian is with you. Oh, what's up, Oh, bro? wow. Welcome, Evian. Hello, Evian. Uh, and one of you guys can control Evian. Evian. Do you have her, uh, her sample? Uh, Nick, do you have Evian's sample? I have got it to memorize. All right, there we go. <laughs> Real? Got it. <laughs> <laughs> Is that real? Do All right, you really? Axel. Yeah, pretty much. Yes. <laughs> Are you lying? I just wanted to get hit. I... That voice gets more memey as I replay it. Oh, it's absolutely. Four, three, three, to hit. All right, with your arrows? Yep. Got it both times. For 23 damage. Okay. Buddy. And then I'm going to lay down on the ground. Pointing at your head like a weirdo. Yeah. All right, two arrows slam into the back of that guy's neck. With a roar, he swats at them like bees, crushing them against his neck and bad. throws the feathers against the uh, ground. That puts us at the pikemen. Uh, um, mm. The contingents of pikemen armed in half plate start moving forward. What? That's, yeah. This is only threat level yellow. Indeed. This is threat level midnight. This is <laughs> yellow. <laughs> Right, level green green is start level like, what? They just summoned a tornado nine. made of knives. Just a knife tornado. <laughs> and they cast old person on it. You know yeah. what? They're going to dash. It's a knife <laughs> they day. cast old person on it. No, don't dash. Oh, oh it's, no. It's dashing time. Oh. So you can see the pikemen Maybe rushing forward. Way. Instead of that way. I'm I'm the, jump it. The, and these guys are just going to hop barricade? here. You're, you're the only one not on the mount. Uh, Evian presumably rode here on like guys. a cool little little mount. What'd she ride her end on? Oh, uh, she might have a horse. horse? Uh, are you using the horse thing here? Let me give you. Uh, there are some large bases in here that can be used as mounts if you can find. Them. Uh, there's huge ones in there mostly, but you can find some large ones in there as well. And that puts us at the spearmen, the ogre spearmen. All right. The one in the center there, seeing uh, people run away from him, is going to try to tear free of his chains once more. All that damage, Nick. Oh, yeah, give it to him. And he can't do it. He's got a really good straight, and he just cannot. Okay, that's not... That's 11. Ooh, Ooh. so 17 slashing damage. Ooh, all right. He's so hurting. Those have all been real good. <laughs> yeah, that, yeah, that's... You're uh, like, that is a nice As step. he's pulling forward, you can see the chains tearing against the ground, dragging along, but you can also see them tearing down across his leg. He's now got bloody gouges in his legs on all sides, and he's roaring and pulling and hefting free. The chains creak as they, they're they strained. That puts us at uh, the other two ogre spear, and this one, at the guy who just crunched up into him, <laughs> in his groin, he goes, Rah! and he stabs his spear straight down for 23 to hit, yeah, that's it. feeling 16 yeah. damage. He All right, killed. he's a good he last one. that guy, <clears throat> he's going to go running forward as oh, far as he can. Oh, boy. Oh, so he's going to go, one, two, three, four. <laughs> That's as far as you can get. He just stuck all the bodies. He's got, he's got an axe wound to the groin. And he does, yeah. yeah he's walking like... All right, that Ow. one uh, roars and starts charging. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Two, three, four, five, six. Three, four... So he's going to be right here. <laughs> My guy running sees that and goes, And he sees oh, an ogre no. yeah, running in stride with him now passing, and the ogre looks to the, uh, his left and hefts his spear overhead <laughs> as he draws near. That puts us at the Frost Trolls. <laughs> oh, no. How could we possibly? I have almost zero <laughs> spell slots and no It'll tree. Fine, It'll be fine. All right. I have no I'm wild shapes. On. Sorry? 30 feet. Basically useless. He's going to go one. This is a fight you're supposed to run away from. Three, Not a chance. Four, five. So that's as far as he can go. And so these guys yes, come in and Yes, group up more. See, I didn't expect you to split the party. That's what happened. I didn't expect you to go to the orcs into attacking. That wasn't something I thought of. That was all you guys. <laughs> this is true. <laughs> All this right. whole fight is your own fault, so, you know. It's cool, though. It's cool, though. <laughs> if we live, we're awesome. That's and if we I die, have... uh, join it's us next time. It's still kind of awesome. I still have... 
most of the uh, potion of fairy fire. Okay. Do I have to keep concentration oh, wow. if it's a potion? No, if it's a potion, it, it the concentration was used when it was made. Yeah. I toss it. Right there? Right right there. What is it? They'll each make dex saves. Huh? What is it? The fairy, fairy fire? fire. Yes! We got a 10, Fail. a 4, and Fail. a 17. Oh, okay. One passes. Well, pick the one you want to pass. This one passes. All right. Short and you can These... throw that fairy fire down right underneath them. Well, I'll carry yeah. it with them as they go. Okay. Basically, it's just going to hit. It's going to be on yeah. those two. All right. Is that it for you? That's it for me. All right. The manticores, can you move each of them forward 50 feet? Are they flying? Oh. So 10? Yeah, they're flying 100 feet up. I'm just going to put them off to the side here. All right, that works. And as they fly forward, this one here, Haley, yep. he's going to fire his tail spikes down into you. Uh, no! She's prone. Does that make a difference? It does have disadvantage. Ah, yeah. So a 14. Uh, does she have half cover as well? A 13. No, no she won't because no. it's so far up. And a 23. Oh, 23 will. Catch that. That's going to deal seven piercing damage. Who am I going to throw that at? As tail throw spikes back at into you from 70 anywhere. feet above. You just, yeah, it's what, just D10 plus it. monk level? Okay. You, know, you could you could stop. This it. one is gonna fly so forward ten more squares. So one manticore looks like it's bearing down on the wall. That's a ten. Right there. Right. <laughs> oh man. Ten ish. All right. That puts us at the orcs atop the manticores. Oh boy. Um. All oh, right. Yeah, they do get to have turns. So go the, ahead. The orc atop go. this manticore. Right. Um. Uh, Looks down to this uh, this Very ogre, weird. and he says, "Move!" And you can see that ogre oh, drop boy. into a sprint, and he starts moving faster. What? He moves up, catching right up next to that guy. This ogre follows, and the pikeman, oh, ordered by this guy, dog. Three, four. Okay. All right. So then Hashtag line him up. Hashtag light him up. I don't know if everyone is going to die to one lightning bolt, though, which is... Oh, no, no, but it'll not. hurt. All right. Bolt, What's thanks, our plan after here, that one lightning bolt? Really uh, mm, yeah, Steam. I hope we get well, like, an eight-hour rest. Fortunately. So Steam can throw more lightning bolts. Is that lightning yeah. This is not. This is Ray Frost. Oh, okay, I was going to say. I, I, can't I lost my lightning yeah. bolt spell template. But Ray Frost is just that twice. Yeah, so. I left it at Reaper one day. Yikes. Gnarly. That's, that's Man, you lose losing everything. So... Hmm. Huh. Wow, like choices, yes. choices, because, I mean, I could move myself. Yeah, this actually would be the time where Fireball was way better than Lightning Yeah, Bolt. yeah, yeah. Well, or a Vitruvian Obscure. Yeah, that'd be great. You know, Too bad it took confusion. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> Why on so, earth would you take Hypnotic so Pattern, go, maybe? Uh, a confusion might be one. what you need to save that guy. That and, would certainly yeah, help but, him, but I'm out but of four whatever. slots and didn't prepare it. But I do have a Lightning Bolt. And I can make that work if I just climb down here. Mm. Oh, and that go, is like, right pretty there. good angle. And I can go. It's not now remember that. that guy's a hundred feet up. Yeah, is so he a hundred feet yeah, up? So it's not gonna hit that guy. But you'll hit so a few. So hit pikemen. the ogre or I, hit the guy up. I the hit the rest of the pikemen over here because it is gonna be one hundred twenty yeah. feet. Yeah. Uh, I'd rather get, get rid of the soldiers. Their mess. I think we get all four soldiers. I think so. I think so. So have four of the pikemen and one of the ogres. So the pikemen do their dexy saves. Well, here, I'll do the ogre first. Dex save, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. That's right. That should have been just a flat 17 mm -hmm. for the ogre. Son of a gun. Wow. Pikeman. Not we great. got a 2, a 10, a 13, and an 18. All right. One pass. One pass. Yes, so uh, we're looking at uh, 22. Might damage 18, on a failure. Armor. Oh, yeah, um, yeah, yeah. Use all right, those. 22 on a fail. Yes. Yeah, well, can he re-roll with the Barnaby dice? <laughs> <laughs> with the Barnaby dice. Can I yeah. spend an inspiration? All right, you can three the yeah. of the pikemen nice. are blasted by lightning. <laughs> Their armor torn asunder. Yeah, get rocked. One of I them can... managed to dodge out of the way at the last second and only took 11 damage. Good for him. Um, And then the ogre took 11 as well. Sure did. I feel so bad for this Yarbeer that really wants to get back. <laughs> uh, he's, <one laughs> he's about to get He's crushed. one of two left. And you see that these are not the only Yarbeer on the field. There are other Yarbeer up on the hills fighting mm -hmm. off orcs that are trying to get yeah. up to mm -hmm. just hop down in. Well, these are just the only ones in y'all's uh, vicinity here. Your boys these are like the on. chiefs. <laughs> All right, Yarbeer. Who still has a Yarbeer? We have, have one. that right. one right there and one over there. 16. Just give your That's last dying breath at the uh, front gate. He is, uh, he, no. 
No, he, he sees that lightning bolt and goes, ah! help, 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 As he's running, he's going to disengage out and just run his full six six cores of movement. He's trying real hard. He can get right up to the gate. Does yeah. he just start pounding no, on No, turn. It? Turn and no, go. Once he's start there, climbing. He's, that's the best he's got. And so he's, All right, he's I, start, can't, I can't have him down. Right. So he's just going to turn and like kind of brace. Hey, if I jumped over this pit, how much movement would I have left? Uh, it only costs 10 movement. It's just a regular 16. jump. Yeah. That's my... My one potion gone. Just should have taken that on the way over. What if you went up the cliff, I'm waited to, got onto the, the barracks, stupid. and then jumped off the barracks? You do that. The uh, Yarbrough Priest is going to recast his Entangle. Oh, good call. Okay, well then go there. They, no, they yeah, go help, go help him using pack tackles. All right. Yarbrough Priest is casting Entangle. What do they need to make? Uh, four, four strength saves and one uh, cow save. <laughs> All right. We have a five, a nine, a six, and a Twelve three. Twelve squares. Wow. What about the cow? Restrain. Cow. Uh, we're just going to say that the cow is uh, is now stuck there and entangled in the vines and tearing against it. Its hide is torn and uh, it, it stumbles down to the ground and is now moaning on the ground. Okay. These right. cows are going to die horrible deaths. Barthoon. Um... I mean, I guess we need to start heading towards the gate. Right? You're on a mount, Yeah! Right? No. I'm not. You're not? Why are you not mounted? I have a horse. I, I mean, think. I guess I'll be on a horse. And well, that's Eddie, right? Yeah, yeah oh, just yeah, ride sorry. with Eddie. Yeah, here. We'll just... We'll yeah, just uh, you could probably have a horse. I mean, they, they offer yeah. you. you okay, well, then I'll, I'll have a horse then. Yeah. Sure. Um, How much movement did the horses have? The uh, horse has 50, yeah. Oh, uh, mine has 60. Jump the fence! Jump the fence. Yeah, I think He's we're just going to see a 14. That's some people hide. <laughs> so probably not. One, two, three, four, five, six. No, free. that and little thing. And it could thing jump this fence, yeah, but because it's a cross pit, it would take it an athletics check. The horse? Mm-hmm. Using his? What no, is using a horse's right. athletics? What is Surely a horse's a, athletics? Well, well, isn't strength it, isn't the long jump three, like... Maybe four. riding horses. Long jump is your strength score, or half your strength score. Right, right, but it's also a high jump and a long jump. Oh, right. So that's the reason, yeah. Uh, and so it's got a strength of plus three. Dude, just barrel it into the wall, plus. jump off the horse. <laughs> <laughs> just Yoshi it. Because you, yeah. don't, you don't know no. that pit is there. Yeah, I mean, you can it's, see it's it. clearly it's visible. Oh, okay. It's, it's visible. You didn't you didn't cover it with. Like, they weren't like to, it, it uh, mm-hmm. made people fall in. They were mm-hmm. there so that people wouldn't go that way. Yeah, they go. Oh, it looks like a pain. God, I don't have not. guidance. I was gonna guidance myself. <laughs> Good luck, then, horse. Yeah. <laughs> don't die. Um, uh, in a moment, Sam is going to begin telling you to do it, and you will be cool. Uh, <laughs> do it, and you're cool. Do it, do it and cool. you're cool. All right. If anything, your horse just plows into the wall. Or falls into the pit with spears in it, and, like, I die. You It'll jump be off fine. Burn? Is that a crit fail? No, it's a two. two. Alright, as your horse leaps up, it catches its legs on the on the uh, wall, <laughs> and it tumbles into the pit. Roll me a dex save. You're not that cool. Come on. Come on, <laughs> on dex save. Ah! <laughs> re-roll, re-roll, re-roll. re-roll. <laughs> <laughs> seven. It's Dex- seven. Oh, so well, it's, it's a cut. Flat. Is it cocked? No, it's, it's All a right. Seven. Tumbling down, you catch the edge of the wall, and you're now hanging over the pit. <laughs> Your next action you can use to automatically get out, or you can roll a uh, an acrobatics check to try to hoist <laughs> yourself up. That will not take an action, but it runs a risk of you falling into the pit. How's the All horse? right. The horse has just been impaled upon spikes. Okay, it's not good. Horses kill. Deal. All right. Guys. Why'd you kill your horse? Do um, it in your cool. Do <laughs> it in your cool. Do it. I hate you. What I you're cool. Man. What I told I'm you not cool. cool. You're cool. I'm hanging you in a do pit it. of spikes. You should almost never do that when Sam says it. Uh, All right, Daddy. Yes, trolls are to the gate. <laughs> to the gate. To the gate. <laughs> Uh, let's see, could I hear I don't know, trolls. <laughs> you heard I know, him. I, I, I heard, heard you. So you have two conflicting voices. I say trolls, he yeah, says gay. Yeah, but he's smarter than you are. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> they're also fairy fired. I'm on the they're, wall. They're, they're fairy, fairy fired. fired. <laughs> but they'll stay fairy Wait, fired. Wait, but what are we going to do? Because we have to keep them out. Uh, and we'll keep and them we're only on yellow. We'll uh, keep them out. And then I'm going to I'm gonna start blue, going. Purple, I'm just I'm just moving. The next one might be white. They'll give up. Exactly. Uh, Call it oh, off. 
They killed our wolves. <laughs> why are we, we going no that way? Why, why, well, do you want to go this way and jump over the jump, thing? Do it no! and you're cool. <laughs> do no. it and you're cool. Just jump on my shoulders. <laughs> Kill me and you'll get over fine. Yeah, just use him. Just He's use like the guy him. in the bob wire. You I'll be a goomba. I'm a goomba. Just <laughs> jump on my head. You can't get all the way the there and you're without fine. dashing. Dash. Uh, that is just a pit, right? It's yeah. just a pit. We can, du- we can jump that because there's no yeah, wall behind it. So we will dash. So that goes one... Colby, Three, can four, five, I six. throw up produce ten, flame ten, as we're going? Ten. Remember, those guys are all difficult to As my action. Right, that's yeah. why I was going around the Oh, oh but we're large. Yeah. yeah. No, so. Can you what? Throw up produce flame at these six, trolls as six. we're going. Uh, eight, nine, when it comes ten, to ten, your eleven. turn, you can. <laughs> uh, but one, two, I think you may be out of three, range by then. Four, five, six. Whoa. Seven, eight, nine, ten. No. Oh, you know what? Your cool. turn. Oh, yeah. yeah it, it, so we can, we can get, get there. there. So Ooh, we're we're just gonna come. Yeah, you're casting the fairy fire as you're going. Yeah, we're we're barreling Threat. around. Um, oh, you're throwing that as you're going now. <laughs> <laughs> we're barreling across. I can't pick. Grant, pick that up, would you? I can't do it. I'm I'm <laughs> incapable. We end up here, uh, having having just wheeled around uh, in front of all. You know of who the, didn't? Yeah, I, I know it's true. Um, <laughs> Oh, you're alive! Yeah, who did? Yes, we are. Uh, and are as we dead? as we go by, no. can you make ranged attacks it's for me? I'm uh, hanging on the edge of the cliff. Okay. Yeah. No. Cool. Well, I'm gonna have you make a uh, uh, animal handling check as you do uh, to see yeah, if it goes the direction you want it to go. Uh, I'm literally I'm really, a two really and then a one. Is it uh, your uh, found seven. steed? Oh, oh, that's true. That's true. Yeah, he wouldn't. Yeah, so you totally can. Yeah. yeah. Uh, in that case, I think it's possible that uh, I found a spare. Uh, longbow that I had strapped to the side of the steed for uh, just such an just occasion. such an occasion. Uh, and I'm gonna take a couple that. shots with it. It's it's not gonna be like good, but it's it's a plus three against a, a advantage to bull targets, and so two hits. First is <laughs> what? <laughs> it double <laughs> three roll. All right, drawing it. Roll. Roll. Okay, let's try. Th- Let's try that again. I used two of my lucky At the last chance, Osborne sneezes, knocking your aim <laughs> right you? into oh. where you wanted to hit. Thank one. you. Uh, ah. And then the second one, also an advantage, is, okay, uh, it's a, it's an 11. 11 and a what? Frost troll. Uh, 11 and a, like, nat 16. So okay, 19. so that one hit, but the 11 doesn't hit. I figured. Uh, so that one is a d8. And, all right, it deals uh, five damage. Okay. <laughs> all right. And that puts us at UI. Let me just keep going. Oh, you're still alive! I say his big barrel towards the gate. Hello! We killed the dreamer! That is that is my life. You killed him! <laughs> Get them away from the gate! Yeah, well, I shoot at this is, guy. Is that the gate in question? This is. Oh, okay. Well, we would have, we would have and I got an 11. 11? All right, taking a shot up at him, the manticore wheels in the Can air, you and you see him hanging on tight, hugging around the neck of the manticore as it barrel rolls through the air. Do a barrel roll. And uh, your strike misses. Just jump. Um, I'm going to step of the wind to dash over here. Okay. <laughs> Nick, can I see step of the wind again? <laughs> That's it. That's it. That's how you do it. It looks a, like a really a bad violent, version of Thriller. Yeah, a, a, vi- a violent Matrix spasm. <laughs> All right. And as you land, you can see that the next banner is starting to Oh, my race. God. We are not no prepped for this. And with that, we're going to take our break. They we'll give take up. our yeah. intermission. We'll be back in 10 minutes at it's, 825. It's a white flag. It's over.